Yeah, what do you think from us? I'm actually joined today by Agrid. How you doing, buddy? Oh, I'm alive. You're a bit tired, though, aren't you? I'm dead, but I'm alive. Yeah, it's a late, late, late Sunday here. Um, Agrid's a little bit behind on the overdrive, so we thought we'd do something a little bit different this week, and um, we'll get in and get him to. Oh, how poorly I placed our citizens. That's all right. We're, we're going to carry your butt to there. We've also got uh, Sandgrabers joining us. Uh, if any of you want to join us, jump on the Discord, and you're more than happy to jump in. Uh, we'll get you an invite, and you can come in and. We'll carry him back up to where everyone else is. So if any of you guys want to get in help, just jump in and um, we'll get it up. And I just realized really quickly, I've got a couple of housekeeping things to do. Um, Sandgraper is also, um, while you're doing the house creeping, mm -hmm. uh, Sandgraper is one of our Western Australian backers. Mm -hmm. He's also been, uh, speak he's up. up to date with, with it all. He can speak up. And he's in so, oh, Will, I was just letting you do your introduction. Hey, people. All right, cool. Um, all right. He's enjoying the fact that he can actually join us because usually... Because Western Australia is so far behind the rest of us, or so far ahead of us, hmm. he always misses us. So, okay, for some yeah, reason, nice change. For some reason, video is not coming up on my streaming PC. I'm just going to refresh Twitch and see if that works. Uh, we now have video. Good, good, cool. So it was just lag on that end. Cool, done, fixed. Right. So we're already in game. I'll cut us across. Bang. Well, you're in game. I'm yeah, still you're... waiting. Yep. I'm loading. You are not very far from me. You must be on Hurston. Ironic. Knowing old man Hurston, he's on Hurston. Anyway. I tend to live on Hurston. I do like Hurston. I don't know why. Yeah. I do too. But no, I can't. It's centrally located, easy to access everything. That's why I do it there. All right, so whereabouts are you up to, Algrid? So we can... Um... I, I have finished one and two. So I need to do mission three. And four. Okay, so... Four. Three was a... Um... Remind me, it was a space battle, wasn't it? Three, three space battle, I think. Three, yes. I believe, is the space battle where you kind of um, mm. go to the location where the, the Xeno threat are gathering mm -hmm. and ambush from base early. I That's did, cool. I did all those in a redeemer, and now I've got my redeemer here at Everest, so we can do that again if you want. Um, and I smashed it out fairly quickly. And I actually think the redeem would work on the comms one as well. Now, so, the I, thing I is, did, um, one and two in my eclipse. Yep. Yeah. Um, but cause there's three of us, we can all just get in it and go do them all really, really quickly. And unless anyone else joins it, then we can dial it up to, you know, high heights from there. Um, but I'm just thinking while well, we've got three of us, um, where about you, Sangropa? Agrim Hex jumping out now. There'll be about three minutes to you. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Right. Well, I'll get the. I'll, I'll wait till Agrid gets up here because he's. Uh, he'll, he'll, he'll. You'll probably get here before he does. Potentially, I can always bring a tally and just pop the hammerheads with that. Yep. Um. Oh, we, oh, again, yeah. three, three in the three in the redeemer. I think we'll be fine. But yep. um, again, we'll probably get some more people joining us as uh, as we go along. Um, Assuming sorry. the mission start, otherwise you'll have to jump servers. Yeah, that too is possible. Um, so yeah, if you guys want to join us, we're just on the Infrunners Discord, jump in, and we're going to all help Algrid catch up, because he's just, yeah, as, as you said, he's got three and four to go, so he's a couple behind. Just for something different this week, um, we were feeling very lazy, and we just couldn't think of a show to do, and I said, how about we just catch you up in Overdrive? And he, and... So, moment, only Overdrive mission number one looks like it's available. Um, Take it. The Overdrive incursion, I think. Oh no, that's uh, Ways of Ships, that's it. Uh, did you go into priority? They're usually listed under priority. Yeah. Um, I just thought it was the, but because it was one of five, I thought it was the old number one mission. You're, you're probably going to have to drive, Agrid, because you're going to have to get us there because we've already done it. So you're going to have to drive, at least to the location, and then we can swap over if you want. Um, or you're going to have to go on a ship yourself, and then we'll walk to you. They're the only two I, ways to I kind of do it. Myself. Hmm. Um, I want that one, but it is not letting me share it. Um, did you get the, um, the last one done, number four, um, Sandgrover? Uh, number four was the surveillance, yeah, the, the comms three, arrays, yes. Yeah, the three comms array and then Korea. How buggy were the comm relays? It is easily the worst, um, for me anyway, I'm just asking. If you, you take a tiger claw, you can actually turn it off. And then it will refire up the mission at the same location, which seemed to work. Uh, okay, well, I didn't do that. I, I, the problem I had was just bugs. Um, I, I literally had a rogue missile come out of the 
like it, it told me I was trespassing after I finished it, and then it killed me with a missile from from the station. And it didn't, even though the the the, the thing had completed, it when, when I respawned, it said I'd abandoned the mission. So I had to redo I the whole thing again. I was like, I think we're seeing a lot of desync at the moment. So yeah. I've noticed that when there's a lot of ships in close priority, you're getting desync issues. So well, I think the ha servers are getting hammered. It's also one of the oldest missions in the entire game. So it really shows how um, kind of out of date and hasn't been updated. I, I was, I find it really infuriating. Um, and little things like um, if one Vanguard came in after the other, it never reset the, um, the little bar. Um, oh, okay. So if you weren't quick enough to take him out, you it like you just didn't kill one and it reset. You it'll just keep going and compound. Um, and yeah, rather infuriating, especially if you're trying to do it solo because it's really it feels like it's more built for three type of people. But yeah, I was doing it with my nephew because he hadn't done any of it until this weekend, and we sort of ran through one and two mm. midweek, and we did three and four just this afternoon. The only issue we had was with that stage four. We joined someone else at uh, SBK and we sort of got there too late so it failed so because of that we jumped servers and picked it up straight away i am seeing people in our service say asking whether surveillance mission is working yep I, as i said i could not get it to work on the australian servers i had to jump over to a us server and it works straight away um so yeah if it's not working we'll, we'll jump ship um is Agri... at everest or oh, i am at everest but i'm wondering where Agri is i'm thinking i might just come down and pick him up it might be quicker i head to lawville are you at we'll you at the asop terminal yet Agri or not no. Yeah, so I'll come down and pick you up. It'll I be quicker. Sorry, Agri? I was lagging. Ah, oh, it's all good. It's fine. We'll get there. Wasn't even walking by choice. No, it's fine. Lovely paint skin. Yeah, I love For it. that Redeemer. I just want a black and red one. I know the default's black and red, but it's... I hate the little that people jump. It drives me insane. It uh, might not the, be to everyone's taste, but the metallic skins are not. One of my guns fell off. <laughs> it's just like, oh, yeah, it fell into the ship. We find people for littering. We will make a mint. I reckon CIG is just hire you to manage Lawville. It would, it would be the most spick and span place, but like everyone would not want to live there. <laughs> Well, true, because they wouldn't want the fines for littering. Yes. And we've got cameras everywhere, so we'd catch you. Yeah. Oh, shit, I'm damaged. I, I would be. I'd be the best money sink that CIG had at Lawful. Mm. I don't see the uh, the Hurstons <laughs> just doing a, a fine. I see them getting their security guards to tase people and then give them a fine. Mm. Ah, yeah, absolutely. Kind of like the uh, guards in Half-Life 2. Pick up the can. You picked up again. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, the amount of little people leave absolutely frustrates the crap out of me. I want a raptor just to clean up that rubbish. And I want people to be fined for littering. Yeah, I can see that. Old Van Hurston's um, raptor being pushed around by Uwe girls. I can see that. No, towed by Uwe girls, mate. Yeah, towed. <laughs> wearing collars, oh god. Yeah, it's like, like Santa Claus, you know. Oh god, the reindeer. Um, there's like one with a red right. nose. <laughs> ooh, 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 reindeer. They, they, get the, they get the reindeer, you know, kind of hat thing, and, and one of them gets a red nose. Yeah. No, I need to hydrate. Dear me. Please proceed to sign landing bay. Fortunately, I'm hosting. I have oodles of... Oodles of noodles, no? Oh. No, oodles of fruit. Fruit? Really? Yeah. Wouldn't you buy Lux? I don't know. I always buy Lux because you can buy that from the, um... The place near the Habs there. Get the name of it, the worker place. Why would I do that when I've got food? Because Lux works as food and drink at the same time. So does uh, some of the foods. So does uh, some of the fruits. I've got lots of drinks as well. I think I just found Lux and I stuck with it, maybe. 
will do. Apples are hydrating. I'm definitely noticing the frame rate issue with um, streaming at the same time. <laughs> it's definitely dropped a few bit, a few frames. Yeah. Oh, it is. It is late years. Oh, it's having trouble auto landing now too. All right, we'll do it the hard way. Wow. 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 It can fly with no power. Okay. No, it's not really that strong that power. It's just that you've um, you've buggered it. Yeah, I did something to it. I know, Paul will be angry at me for hurting his favourite chip. Paul will love you for damaging that chip. <laughs> true. Very true. Free food and drinks. Okay. Well, we're going to have a few European people up. on with the C. I see. If you guys want to join us, just jump on the Discord. You're more than welcome. We're just helping Agra get his overdrive done. Because uh, he's a little bit behind. You guys need more people? Um, let me know. Yeah, yeah sure. Jump in, cuz. No problem. As I said, just yeah, we're on the Discord. We're in a public channel. You can jump right in. Yep. And um, you can even talk. Radical content. Might not be able to get me added because people have a lot of problem finding my name for some reason. But yeah, you might be able to add Sangro Pro or Algrid and, and, and jump in and join us. I am Al Garrett, as is as in the chat yep um i think he's trying to do number three and then we're going to do number four yep. yeah i'm um, just getting caught up i'm just trying to get some fruit or something because i or a bottle mm. anything there will be some in the back of the redeemer yeah um i'm in hangar three guys when you're ready to go i don't want to get in the redeemer Ugh. well too bad we're carrying your butt through this so hurry up oh, i want to take the eclipse you guys can come. Uh, I wouldn't take the Eclipse. You'll probably die. It's a little bit paperweighty, and there's too many enemies. Um, it's just easier if you come in and reclaim it, because then we can carry you through it, Agrid, and it'll be much faster. All right, well, Sangrope is here. Well, he was here, and then he... And then you got back in the elevator. Yeah, I just wasn't seeing a tag above you. I oh, thought no. maybe I'd gone to the wrong spot. No, and I need to go onto that ghastly ship and yeah. steal some of your drinks because I cannot. Um, I've got drinks on me too, man. I can just give you some. Can't access my inventory, so. Yep. Can you put, grab things off the ground? or? I don't know yet. I'm yeah, assuming I'll be able to grab things off the ground. Yeah. But I, I just spent the last five minutes trying to get. Yeah. Well, I just I just grabbed any cool. armor because um I was going to Korea to do that mission. When you get to Hangar Three, I've got a drink here for you. Yes, I can pick things up off the ground. You you want to take the top turret, Sangrapa? Uh, you sure you don't want Al Garrett on that one? No, no, I'll, I'll put him on the bottom, bottom one. one. No, no, no. I'll put you, I'll put I'll put him on the uh, on the bottom one. And put you on the top. Okay. Definitely a vote of confidence there. Hey, dude, you play with Jen. I know how, how much you carry his ass, so you can help me carry this uh, Agrid's. That's who we should add in here. That would have been funny, actually. Have, get, get Jen in here. Get him to carry Agrid. That would be funny as hell. <laughs> yeah. He'd, be, he'd probably have the night with his wife, though, tonight. I think he's going to be on late tonight. I think he's been down to Sydney today. Oh, really? Oh, okay. Well, maybe, hopefully, he might get on and join us, or we can raid him as we finish or whatever. Are you on your way, Agrid, or...? Yes. Okay. You're an impatient bastard. I am. I'm very impatient. There he is. All right, here we go. I'll put this drink down for him. If it'll even let me. Wow. Uh, place. There you go, mate. You're actually carrying something right now, by the way. I know I'm carrying a bottle of water that I picked up off the ground so that I could actually see if I could pick things up off the ground. Well, um, you need to take your helmet off too to drink them, but anyway. Um. There he goes. All right, and yeah, helmet's off.
Yeah, good. All right, let's go. Right, did did the did you actually get the mission yet, Agrid, or not? Yeah. All right, cool. Wouldn't let me share it when I took it. Um, no, because we've already done it. Did you roughly know where it was? Like, um, what planet? I haven't looked. Okay, cool. I haven't looked. Well, if you get yeah. on if you get on the ship before you have a look, um, we can start moving. When we Howdy. work as we move. Hey, Lady Grace. Hey, how's it all going? Good, good, good. We're streaming at the moment. That's fine. Yeah, I need another ball, though. Oh, you need another one? I'll give you another one. Come, come and hop in the ship and I'll give you another one. Um... Okay, so oh, it's the back of the ship, isn't it? Ghastly. Yeah, it's Piece of rubbish. Oh, it's a means to an end. Yeah, I agree. just picked up shit. Yep. Hey, great, Agrid, I dropped the bottle here. Come back, bro. Get on ship, get on ship, get off your ship, get on ship. Washy bastard. Yeah, you do as the general says, go now. <laughs> general pain in the house, or major pain, yeah, major pain. There you go. All right, good yeah, job. Well, you're going to get, you're going to get fined by, I'll just tell you, you're going to get fined by Hurston now. Yeah, probably. Um, can you close that, make sure the door's closed when you get on, bro? I'll get us taken off and you guys can get in your turrets. Um, do you remember how to set your turret up? With the, um, like, turn gyro mode on and all that other shit off and whatnot. Uh, I can close the back door from here. It's fine. Uh, Lady Grace is looking for an invite to party. Uh, yep. Uh, give me a second. Are you on the server, Lady Grace, or are you... Yes, they are. Okay. Um, give me a second. You, uh, just Lady Grace is the name, I assume? Yep. Yep, gotcha. Uh, yep. Invite to party. Um, Cheers, is. Yep, too easy. Are you doing space or ground part? Uh, we're doing the number three, the space one. Okay. Just going to get Agrid kept caught up. And then uh, get him on a number four, obviously. Yeah, I haven't done four yet. Cool. Well, yep. Yeah, we again, if if anyone wants to do four, we're happy to build all as a group. That's fine. Um, right, let's see where they say to get it. Uh, I say. Da, 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 da. Well, they, the they, they won't say. You got to go into the map and look. Um, and I'll go into general. There it is. You know, every time you do lurching moves, it actually kills the Obi uh, Moby's last, don't you? No, I didn't know that. Sorry. No, just thought that you know. Yep. Uh, we are going to looks like Crusader. Um, as a do do you know if you were in the turret, that wouldn't be happening. Sitting down, I can't access my mobile glass. At least that's what I find on my ships. And we are going to Yella. Well, I can do it. I just did it right then. You're lucky. Oh, you don't get the chance to do that. It doesn't let me. No, you can't use the mobile from inside the turrets here. Oh, really? Okay, my bad. Well, you won't have that problem now. We're at warp. So go nuts. I think we lost Agrid's camera. Oh, we did. Is your camera overheated, Agrid? Uh, it shouldn't be. That means I tried to get to that turret, and I'll tell you once I'm in there. Roger, Roger. Did you hear the Astropub solution for his over uh, overheated overheating camera? Yeah, he's got a fan. I've got one as well. But yeah. I, I brought one specifically tailored for my camera that uh, kind of attaches to the back. When the screen folds out, it's kind of got like a spring mechanism, and it 
it kind of clips in where that was, but not all cameras have this, but it's a relatively new problem because they're not designed to do video. They're really designed for photos, but Sony has lent into this, um, they call it the ZVE 10 and the ZVE one and two. Um, they're designing them more for videos than photos. Like for example, they don't have a range finder on them. Um, we're probably going to get out a new one soon. We're waiting for the new one to drop. There's a Mark two that's meant to drop in the next month or two. So we're trying to hold out until then so you can get a new one. So we're about to you at the moment, Lady Gross. Uh, yeah, you're 18. I'll probably just grab a tally. Yep. But I mean, whereabouts are oh, you yeah, down at Art Corp? Yep. Oh, I can see you. <coughs> I was thinking, Agro, if we get a few more people on, maybe you can jump... I know you don't like the reclaimer, so maybe you can jump onto another ship. Monster, Avery eh? said he'll join us in a bit too, so... No reclaimer would be a bit of interest. Sorry, what would? I thought it said reclaimer. I mean, did I say reclaimer? I said, re I said oh, it, we're in a it, redeemer. It reclaimer. He means that piece of rubbish called a redeemer. <laughs> it's not rubbish, it's built for a purpose. It's actually one of the oh, recommended yeah. chips for this. Like the, they put chips on sale for this, and this is one of the ones that were on sale. It is actually a good chip for it. Yeah, it's really good. Agrid's got law reasons to hate things, so his things are a little bit more um, fictitious. Let's say, oh, I've okay. got a personal chip against that one mm. uh, because with the next great Starship contest, I was designing something that wasn't a gunship, mm. and then they changed the contest to say you had to be a gunship. So yeah, I actually like the boom slang, but I just don't think it was very origin. Let's just put it that way. Oh, there are a lot of ships that are not where they really should be. Yeah, there's a couple of ships that would really benefit from being handled. Well, well, in hindsight, now we look back, they they really didn't have the manufacturer um, star guides down, did they? You know, or they no. or they were very internal, so to speak. So we never really got to see them. They ever did that but, again? That, that's know, what... the thing they were really doing was um looking for engineers yeah yeah but still in hindsight if they did do the competition again that would you and i've talked about this before i could quick guy yeah passionate but yeah um how can you style as a ship if you don't know what the style is you know um i was gonna make us land at seraphim but we don't really need to land at seraphim do anything um because lady grace can just turn up um, yeah, the, the other one though, if if you want to land at Seraphim and bind there, mm -hmm. then if you have a whoops, it's a shorter flight. If you're going to keep working over that asteroid belt. In the faster ships, it doesn't make much difference. It's F7, isn't it, for shields? I'm trying to, I'm, I am trying to remember. It is F7 for the, what is it, what's it called? The, um... Or manually drag power. the power table around. Yeah, that's the one. Power, yep. Yeah. Uh, shields. There we go. I just want to get those shields up real quick because they, for some reason, they didn't charge. Uh, yes, it does look like my camera died. Mm. Again. That's all good. I'll, I'll, turn your, I'll turn your thing off. It's fine. It's definitely going on its last legs, though, unfortunately. Yep. Yeah. Oh, well, it is a five to seven years old, so. Yeah. It had a good run. It's uh, survived a lot better than yours did. Well, as I said, um, even when mine stopped doing video, it still did photos fine. So just retire it to photos. And you'll be fine. We'll get you a new one. Okay. Um, so, Agrid, you're probably going to have to fly us to the location unless yep. you can um, tell me where it is. But I'll, I'll get us to yellow it's and yellow. Then, you, then you can take over. Well, I can tell you after that. Right. Why the hell is it not giving me a marker? They're doing this old thing where it's 
Oh, it's back on again. No, we should be able to fly straight to the yellow. In fact, isn't that yellow right there? Possible pig. What the hell is going on? I think it's still in this old. Uh, it's still in the old OM bug again. Hang on. I think we might have had a server issue at Louisville there, Algrid. Our uh, Moby glasses are now working in the turrets. What? Jeez. Well, you know, that's uh, Hurston technology. What, because we're away from Hurston and it's working? No, it's just uh, Hurston technology worked for you. Right. I gave an upgrade as we were leaving. Okay, we can now go to yellow. What the hell was that? I have no clue. I had yellow set and wouldn't let me warp there, and then I unset it, and now I can manually do it. That's whatever. Crusaders, um, woeful, mm. um, you know, Wi-Fi. We all know that post, uh, Crusader um, are well-meaning, but have no... Um, But no governance skills. Right. Which I, th I think is is wrong. Oh, step away from the pilot seat. Someone get out now, please. I can't get out. Let me out, please. Thank you. There you go. Go for it, bro. All yours. You can. You've got a tractor beam. What's the gun? What gun do you have there? I can't quite make it out. It looks like an AK almost. It is just the uh, regular. PA4, the one you can pick up from uh, looting Roger. dead people. Roger, Roger. Most of the stuff I use is looting dead people. I was really missing my um, suppressor yesterday. That was pissing me off. Huh? But I still managed to take out all, all the guys at Korea. They kept spawning pretty fast, though. Well, you'll see, hopefully, if we get there today, if we get far enough. The stream's pretty much gone until Agra gets exhausted, right? So. Whoa! Okay. Yep, you put me on my ass. Well deserved. Yeah, it's nice, isn't it? <laughs> hey, he got me back. Well done. Vengeance is mine, so... Uh, <coughs> yeah. Alright, let's swap back. Hang on. Thank Greg, do you remember what we're up against here? It, it, it's it's like it's a, a, hammer, a ha it's... hammerhead with a cluster of little things around it, yeah? And there's a couple of them. It is. Yeah, it is 24 right. ships in total. Each one is centered around a hammerhead and it has a cluster of five support ships. Yep. Right. Gladiuses, Buccaneers, and Cutlass Blacks. I love right. the way you know, X, X complains that I was in the way of him when he yeah, was it was Yeah, it was desync, bro. Sorry. I yeah, yeah, yeah. Um... Just let me know when you're in the turret, mate, or starting the animation, and then I'll get moving. I don't want to knock your butt again. You're good? Yeah. All right. I assume we're heading basically to the big rock? Uh, yep. I had you lined up. Oh, sorry. I did move it. My bad. You did. Yeah, how good or how good can always fire. Guy yeah, on target. that's a good idea. I could just fire where you want me to fly. That way? Yep. Roger it. Do you want us to focus the hammerhead first or the support craft? I don't know. What do you feel? You, 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 I can mark targets if you want, what I'm kind of looking at. Well, there we go. We'll just kill them as we oh, come in, I guess. The hammerhead. Oh, okay. We'll you. focus the hammerhead first. Yep. That's your turret, is it? Wow. Yep. Target is one. Press one on the keyboard, it'll target. You guys should be in range now. There's the other little ones. Rolling. Multiple hammerheads close to each other yeah, here. You got Roger, two clusters. Pulling out. Getting us back a little. Boosting backwards. He's coming at us. I don't know about you, but with the desync, I've been noticing the missile uh, charging. Fight. Yep, I don't work.
We're in range of two hammerheads. I'm going to turn and burn. Yep. I'll let you charge while we do it. I cannot turn on cruise control for some reason. It is not working. I've built manually. Turn it back around. Just that one. We'll probably have some of the smaller targets closer as we go yep. back into comp. That's what I was hoping to. Too low, too low. All right, cruise control's working again. I must have turned, um, sorry, too low. There's two low targets close. Yeah, Roger. Uh, Dragon Daily, I'm going to take him. He's 500 out. Should be in range now. He's over to us. Yep. Uh, make him two. If you press two, you can target him. Uh, or three. Two or three. More missiles incoming. Targeting two, the hammerhead. Yep. What the... Oh, was that a rock? That had to have been a rock or a ram. Uh, a ram. Looks like an enemy. Yeah. Yep. Yep. Don't worry, I've got a Connie at Lawville as well. Sorry, uh, yeah, Redeemer at Lawville. Well, we're going to always break up into two ships now as well. Um, I'm going to take my ex. Uh, I believe yep. Monster Avery is after an invite. If yep, you type sure. in Global Chat Monster Avery. No, I can get him. I was I'm not sure if they're in the server yet. That's all right. I'm, I'm noticing all the old problems are still relevant, like ramming and shit like that. Um, really prevalent. And I'll reclaim it and um, it'll be good to go again. So what are you going in this time, Agra? Do you want to come with me in a hurricane or you, what do you want to do? No, I'm going to take a, a missile boat, I think. All right. Tally. Maybe I'll get Monster or Sandgrove with me. Or, though. or a, um, or the Eclipse. Mm -hmm. I know the Eclipse does, uh, have, takes out hammerheads It's quite nice one. Imagine the... Tally wall as well. Where are you at, San Grupa? Are you at uh, I'm Everest? at Lawville. I can't see your market. Yeah, I'm near. Oh, I'm, back up at, I'm back up at Everest. Okay, I'll head up to you. I'll fly up to you yeah. if you want to gunner. Well, it's going to take you a while on the train. I'll come down and get you. How about that? Okay. Wait, I'm okay. not at Everest. What the hell? Where am I? I'm at Seraph. Whoa! I'm at Seraphim. Okay. Someone's calling me. Um, sorry, monster. Hang on. I'll, I did mean to. Yep, hang on. Too many things to do. Um, get him invited. Do you want me to head out and pick you up, execute? I'm all well, I'm at Seraphim. Yeah, well, that's close to where the mission is, isn't it? Yeah, so I can yeah. just well, again, if you just get here, I can yep. um, wait for you. Execute, um, did you want to fly a tally? I'm, I'm at Seraphim. Um, not really. <laughs> Tally's not my thing. Um, it will be after the rework, though. I am, I am looking. That is one of the shows we talked about doing was the the rework on the retaliator. But I just think it was enough there because it's going to be more more stuff to talk about after it's out. Um, Have you got um, pre footage? Sorry, mate. Have you got footage of it before? Because like this one, you can see the um, the magic boxes they put into keep air in the turrets. Yeah, I, well, I, I'm more interested in things like the the. Because it's got size two gun turrets over it, right? And that's just so out of date. It's like the Vanguard. They're too small. They they need to be upgraded to at least a size three or if not bigger. And then also it's made for five people when realistically that only really needs two or three people on the entire ship. And I'd, I'd imagine a pilot and two turret gunners. And at the moment, there's just like so many extra people on that thing. Um, and I'm hoping they cut the number quite a bit or quite drastically, but we'll have to wait and see. Up oh. Panthers threes. If they, if they're going to keep a number of crew up, I'd have to go check, but I remember them being size two. But Algra did say size three during uh, the week. Uh, mostly size yeah, it's three. Good. We're a couple of size twos now. So I think it's three size, three turrets of threes of twin size threes and well, two maybe they, of maybe size they, two. Maybe they buffed them then. And I think they like the at one point because at one time I my memory is they were all the same size at one point. No, I'm not getting anything coming up. I'll have to have a look at it. Maybe someone in chat can look that up for me, if you'd be kind enough, and just let me know. I'm sure someone will bring it to my attention. 
But I'm just curious to know, because I, I remember them being size twos, but again, they probably did a pass so at some point and brought them up to threes. Um, but right now it is a very, it's, it's the largest ship at the cheapest price, if that makes sense. So like it's 150 bucks. It's kind of a bit of a, a steal. I know you're not getting the, the, uh, internals, <laughs> but like, it's still a, it's a pretty cheap buy for what it is. Um, yeah, considering you get it's all the avionics for 150. Well, it's double the price, uh, for, for the, the bomb, uh, the torpedo base. Hmm. Yeah. Um, and originally the torpedo base didn't come with torpedoes. Hmm. Although I think they, I think that was a, a distinction they made. If you had the bomber variant, it got torpedoes initially, but if you bought the modules, yeah, you can get torpedoes. But I'm going on memory from a long time ago. Well, it's like when you went on the Gladiator, Algrid. We, 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 we sometimes go out and fly the Gladiator. That's only got two size two turrets on it too. The, um, the Vanguard has only got uh, two size twos on that turret as well and it just it's almost the opposite of the hurricane where you and i talk about the psychology of that algorithm because it's got a size five gun on the nose and then four nose guns why the hell would you even bother getting in the turret like it's just, it's like a fly swatter next to a nuclear bomb it just it makes no difference yeah and that that is the thing the one thing i do really like about the the hurricane the mm. um is the fact that the, if you're in the gunner if you're a gunner in the hurricane you you actually have purpose you've got more guns than the pilot so the pilot actually works with you to actually get you on target can you so imagine it, if it was like gun if it was two size threes on the top and then there was like a chin turret on the on the uh warden or the vanguard and that was size threes but they were both controlled by the turret gunner so you can literally shoot all around like and it was like remote and you can shoot all around the ship and it just fires guns that it can fire whatever that would be awesome um, and then you just leave the the nose guns just for the pilot. I reckon that would work really. And you could also make it so that the turret is locked to the um, the chin turret is locked to the pilot when no one's in the turret. That would solve the issue for me. Um, but yeah. Well, they they do have it, but generally remote turrets can be uh, slaves to the pilot, which is my understanding why uh, the Gladiator guns aren't slaves to the pilot. Yeah. So no, I haven't read anything about. The turret sizes on the retaliator. I'd have to. I don't have one to pull either, so I couldn't actually pull it and look at it. I'd have to I'm pretty back. sure it's a split split load of size twos and size three okay. on the guns. So well, that explain it then. My one sitting on uh, pad six. I oh, hang a six at Seraph. But you, you, want to you, look. you you'd have to store it and then go look at the gun turret sizes. That's how I would do it. Um, and and I reckon Sangrab is right. If it's a mix of twos and threes, that's why we're both going. Oh, it's two. It's three. But it, but that explains a lot. Well, they definitely panthers on the top. Let me have a look myself. I'll, I'll uh, make sure I've got one. Well, you need to get on your way here because you need to be I there wish... when it's completed, Algrid. The other comment I'd make for this mission for the um, stage three, where you've got to kill the hammerhead and support craft, kill, mm -hmm. blow up the ships, don't let them go to a soft death state. Yes. Oh, I would have done that anyway. I found on mission two, you just blow up the hammerhead and fly away. Mm. And then you come back. Yeah, that'll work. And at that point, they they all leave. Okay. Vehicle, your vehicle has. You, how far away are you now, uh, Sangrub? Nineteen million k's, but not far. I'll be there in about a minute and a half. Then I've got to jump around. Crusade. What about you, Algrid? You're on your way yet? About to get into my ship. Mm. I was going to look at the retaliator and tell you exactly what the turrets are. Yeah, we'll do it later. It's not a priority. Priority is getting you there and and getting it done. Oh, seven, everyone. Howdy. Hey. Hello. Hello. How do I join you? um just shoot someone an invite if you send a friend's request to me i've got my name in discord it's pretty easy to find my name and then you okay. can join off our server and put a message in global and we'll let you yeah. or you can join off me because my name's the same as it is in the server as well we have an account with old man elgar or old man Hurston. i miss my distortions 
Um, wonderful fancy pint. While I'm waiting for you guys saying if I switch this button over, that will do that. And yep, cool. I'm gonna turn all our good cameras off because these cameras died. Um, where is it? Oh, you mean it's come back? No, no, no. It's just a big black square. Everyone can yep. see a big yeah, black square. Yeah, you A big black square is showing our grid door. <laughs> That's all anyone can see. Right. Well, um. Probably. Okay. My camera is dying. Yeah, we'll get it fixed. All right. Um. So if we go, where is it? Pledge store. And then we go to ships. And do the old school way. And then go. Tell. No. Hey, calls. No. Oh. Oh, I put two tapes in. Yeah. So this one. Pirates. Okay, I'm joining on some grouper. So, so, so I am technically on the sales page. So this may be out of date, but it says it's it's got size twos installed, two per mount, okay. to, total mounts of five. Yeah, I originally had all size twos. I'm pretty certain it's got three size, three size, all right, three well, turret. Uh, okay. Three yep, I'll I'll Wikipedia it then and see if it's been updated. So, um, um, try. It definitely got updated. Like the Matrix of Lies never got updated. Of lies. Yep. Let's have a look again. The the what you're experiencing here is the same problem everyone has. That shit is so old and out of date. Um, retaliator bomber. There we go. Right. And it's which version of its history do you remember the most? Yeah. And that's the problem. And that's the constant problem we have, isn't it? Like me and our grid will remember things from all the way along and update them as we go. But you'll get someone that'll come out and go, well, in 2016 they said this, in 2017 they said that, and it just. Well, even we do that. Yeah, and that's well, that's why we've changed to trying to be accurate right, to just. I'm, it, I'm remembering five three turrets. Yeah, if we have an cool. if we have a little argument like this, it's just go find the truth. But it it doesn't matter who's winning. It's not a competition. Yeah. It's it's find the truth. No, it's a matter of yeah. trying to find out. Yeah, correct info. Yeah. Uh, it still says. I'm just floating here, looking at the retaliator. That. Okay, so it's saying is... that it's got four size twos and six size threes. So I think you're right on point. Um, Sandgraper, that's what it's saying. So three the, size three parts with size size threes. And, um, yeah. Well, if you look here, if, if, yeah. If you look on the screen, it says man turret. There are five size fours that turn into four size size twos, and then it's got a six size threes. God, yeah. That's that is a cluster. Yeah. So that is a clusterfuck. It's three turrets with twin guns on each turret. Mm. So four size twos and six size threes. Yeah. No, no. Three turrets, three and which have double size three gun, and mm. two turrets with double size two gun. Yeah, yeah that's, that's how nice. I that's how I read it. Yeah, but still clusterfuck. So uh, let's hope that gets rejigged for less crew. Because uh, I don't know, I don't know. You go well. Me and Agra are kind of on the same page. So uh, I'll put it to you guys that are in Discord with us. Do you think that it needs less people? Just a yes or no. Tangrupa, hello. I'm thinking how to answer the question. I think it's an interesting with that. It'd be great if some of those turrets became remote. That way you could yeah. have a person covering a couple. It's either, believe... well, they're the two solutions, isn't it? It's essentially make it remote or make it so that it is um, like they're up gunned essentially. And maybe have like one big one on top and one big one on bottom and that's it. So there's a couple of ways they can do it. But yeah, I'm cool. Oh, hey, expert. How you doing? See, I can't read Twitch chat when I'm in. In, in game. Oh wait, yes I can. I gotta look over there though. And then it looks like yeah. I'm being rude. Yeah, the, I can't the read that while I'm in game. Hmm. Yeah, the problem with the retaliator turrets is the upper port and starboard crew turrets mm. are set lower than the midline of the ship. Yes. This so true. if you're in one of those two ones, and those are two of the ones that have the smaller guns, mm. you can only see left like if you're on the port one, you can see to the port side of the ship, from the wing up slightly, you're blocked a little bit forward by the front of the ship, mm. and you're blocked aft by the 
by the stabilizer. See, I think a lot of that so can those be re- guns are just useless. I like, think those, lot- those two should just go. Well, you know how the whole all the beds are up on that set, set uh, second top level. Like if you drop the crew count, you can probably just put the a double bank bed down in the captain's quarter and just have two people and you're kind of done. Someone just opened the hangar here. Uh, it's not one of you guys though. Um, I'm in no. hangar three, Sam Gripper. When you get here, heading to you now. Yeah, Bridget. Yeah, the, the original that... concept and early model was very different. And mm. one of the things with the glass, if you look at the glass on the outside of the model for the Retaliator, mm. it doesn't match the interior. So yeah. the interior of the ship actually blocks out a lot of the canopy. And there's enough space in glass for a pilot and a Rio because originally it was going to have a bombardier. That's yeah. why you've got that weird second cockpit. Yep. Same with the Gladiator too. That was meant to be a bomber too. So I'm kind of used to where that, that, that's going, but I think sadly me and Algrid kind of, well, Algrid, we pretty much think they're going to turn them into separate ships, yeah? Oh, which one's separate ships? Sorry. So, so, so remove the bombing ability from things like the Retaliator and the Gladiator and turn them into separate ships like the A1 and stuff like that and the A2. I probably will do that. I hope they don't. Yeah. Like I, I think they've copped on that because the Retaliator bomber is literally the bomber. And the one thing I wonder if they're going to add this here is a an iron bomb bay so that it can drop bombs like all like the A1. What are talking about? Yeah, but like it would be an easy upgrade sell for CIG to sell a bomb module that just drops yeah. iron bombs. I, and they could even sell two of them, a small bomb and a big bomb, and people would buy both. Well, the other thing is, like, Gladiator is also meant to take cargo. Like, I just right. know how much a lot of that older stuff has changed. Like, well, um, I, I hope they keep the Gladiator, because yeah. that's, that's a strong lore. Like, it's it's a ship that was, yep. you know, lost squad. It's a ship that was instrumental in helping people get out of, out of um, you know, when the Vandal were attacking. I think it was Orion. Or I always get the, the system that was, that was in. But it, it, um, you know, it was instrumental in doing bombing runs. It was instrumental in dropping supplies. It was instrumental in helping people get out. Um, it was a little. Cool. Hang on, we got to do it manual. Uh, <laughs> That's all right. It's two hundred K. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, I could. Go can ahead. you can you send an invite to the Cos five seven five execute? Uh, it's on the server. Uh, yep, Roger. Cos. Yeah, please. Yep, yep. Sorry. Yeah, uh, Agrid. Sorry. So, so the Gladiator is, is a ship I really do hope they keep the, the ability to drop bombs as well and give it a module to, sorry, to do that. Sorry, I'm going to interrupt you again. You said COS 775 or something? Uh, yeah, the the, the chat. COS. Yeah, it's in global chat. The underscore COS 575. I'll look at his name. I've got global turned off. Oh, co- the COS, right. That's why I yep. can't find him. Looking for yeah, my C and K and I'm going, where the hell is this thing? It's the Z the that threw me off. Sorry, Agrid, interrupting Please. again. My bad. Uh, it happens when you're playing. Yeah, it does. Sorry. It's why when we were playing, I actually stopped talking because I'd start. Well, I'd stop playing because I'd start talking and. Yep. But I am, I am in, in do, warp, so you know there's do, not do, much to do. Do you know how many ships you got left to do, Algrid? Does it say on your screen how many are left? On a mission one or five. If, you're tracking if you track it, it, yeah, it should it be will the tell you the number. Of... Yeah, top top middle of the screen if it's tracked. Because we, we just don't want to kill them all before you get here. Um, just one of five. Oh, okay, Looks cool. like a little bar is about. Yeah. Just neutralize all the ge- 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 threat, uh, the Xeno threat ships. Mm-hmm. And the circle's kind of at like a quarter of the way through. Yep. Well, once we get there, you guys uh, that are not, don't have the quest like us can just warp to us so that will speed it up i think we'll stop like 20k's out and get another couple of people in here first what do you think sand yeah really to make sure our grid's here pretty close and then we can start picking off the edges yep yep well he's coming in you can see him flying in he's slowing down as he hits crusader now the real question is, because going back to the tally, does it really need its guns up gun? It is incredibly tough as it is. If it keeps that, I don't think its it guns will. are there to, I, I don't to fight they, little stuff off. I don't think it will keep that. I ha- I flew the tally in the one of the original Xeno threats, and that's when I realised it had the the side three guns as well. And with side three guns with a full crew, it was 
it was it was lovely. It was and it the was, capacity on those guns. Yeah, it was Terrible. chewing up. It was chewing up people all, all the time, uh, like the Xeno three. Um, it, it was surprisingly good. Um, and I, it makes me understand why they thought, you know, why Sergi thought, well, what would happen if we upgunned the tally and took out the torpedoes and turned it into an anti fighter platform, which is the birth of the. Um, we probably want to take out the smaller stuff yeah. first. Execute. Is that a hammerhead? Oh shit! I went through. Yeah, that's hammer. a hammerhead. It's got the small. It's small very hammer. red. It's very red though. So we're like super red. Can, uh, I, lend <laughs> can I lend my aim? We can target that Ken guy. Yeah, we're gonna. Hear. Yeah, go for it. Jump out. Uh, what's that one? Yep. Yeah. Atlas Black. I think the thing that hurts the tally most is it doesn't have a co-pilot seat. So all yeah. the seat functionality they're working on doesn't really work. That's yeah. Gladius is mm -hmm. one. Got it. Out of rain. Yeah, yeah. We're, we're almost there, Goat. Nice. That's just the hammerhead left from this cluster. Roger. We can always leave this for an execute uh, when um, our group gets here. What's the kill count, Algrid? Every time you ask, I've got to look at the mobile glass. I can't tell you. you got to track it. Oh, you, it should be on your screen. If you track it, it'll be there every single time. Oh, two of 24. Yeah. Two of 24? We just killed three. I don't make well, sense. Uh, two, two left, isn't it? Recharging. Yep. I'll just get the shields down. That firing. I got five shots. Three, three, one, zero. Recharged. Recharged. Yep, good. The real question is, is how they'll rework the um, torpedoes. We're going to move shields are... down on the back. We lost something. Yeah, we did. Uh, right wing. Got, got us on the turn. Recharging. Recharging. Yeah, I'm on. Uh, back shield know. is still down. Yep. I think it's because he, whatever he hit. Can't actually see the shields on this screen. No, yeah, front's up. Yeah, front's good. Front's taking a hit. Still so taking down the white for Albert. Well, I'm not getting the count of kills you're making, so... Mm, okay. Well, Lady Grace is here, so she can probably put a torp on it. There it goes. No, no, I didn't put a torp on it. I was just going to get its attention. Yeah, well, it's dead. Soft death. So we need to torp my kill it. <laughs> I usually likes torpedo bombers to, to shoot at. He blows. Damn, what happened to that wing? Damn. That clip... You didn't need it. You only lost oh, yeah. missiles. Yeah, it did a buff out, no problem. It only cost me like 5k. Anyway. Um... Alright, well, most of the other stuff's going to be down near that big rock anyway. Yeah, we just need to wait till our arrow grid gets here. Yeah. Almost, almost. The navigation was playing upon me. I probably know. recommend you walk to us when you can. You know, we're closer. And you go in and cover each other, I guess. It wouldn't let me. So, oh, yeah, you, you, you will have to go to yellow first. Um, I'm in the server if I can get a party invite. Yep, sure. Who am I inviting? Name, please? Yeah. Uh, Jez the Demon. Jez the Demon. Uh, screen? Yep. G, G or J? I'm assuming it's J. Uh, G. It is G. Jez. G E Z. Jez the demon. Gotcha. Yep. yep. Jezza. 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 Have you ever seen that, um, V the Victor with the toad, the cane toads animation? Victor, he's built like a brick shit house. Have you ever? <laughs> very, that very, very, a bell. very, very old now, like literally like 2000, but man, it's funny as hell. If you ever want to look that up, um, yeah, just 
the, oh, I can't even remember what it's called. I think I think it's this Bazza and Dazza or something like that. And there's these cane toads, and they're talking about like how his mate's probably dead, and he's sitting in what looks like a jacuzzi, but it's actually a dog's bowl. It was an advert, wasn't it? No, no, it was a it was animation no? done by a student. Yeah, and it was okay. really well done. Um, just really, really funny and really well done. It's really dated now. Yeah. Like it, it literally came out like I think it was like nineteen ninety nine or something like that. But yeah, it was really funny. All right, where's old man Hurston? I mean, just getting close. Have caused the nav is being a bitch. You getting that bug with the um? I'm getting the bug where I even had you targeted, and I went to warp, and it actually picked a different target. Ah, like it was inverting the ship to actually take it. Which was really frustrating. Well, we don't have to put up with it for long, thank God. That new system, the new star map yeah. and all that will definitely make it easier, hopefully. And then the new warping. Can you imagine selling these points as salvage points to people? Yep. The ability to drop beacons. I remember them talking about beacons like as early as 2015, so that's been a long time coming. All right, where is he now? There he is. Actually, it's probably might be easy for you to warp to the area, Agrid. Otherwise, you're going to be 20 kilometers behind us. So just warp into the actual area and we'll come to you. Where is he now? 28. Now, the question is, is it a high value target or is it the. Uh, we don't know. We haven't gone in. All right, everyone move in. Go for the rocks. He's here. He's 28 Ks. Out. The mission markers can get quite dodgy on their location. Okay. Um, and the big thing for. The high value targets are the hammerheads, I believe. Yep. The big thing to remember is make sure you destroy the ships, not just soft death them. Yep. Well, they're around here somewhere, so we'll have to find them. But Agrid's probably got more idea where they are than the rest of us because he's um, the only one really with the mission. They've been around a while. They can fly 40, 50 kilometers up or down as well. Yep. So if somebody's fighting them and flees, they'll chase them right out of the asteroids. Well, well, we came in, like, trying to jump in above, and that's how we found that hammerhead. It was actually up above us. So. Can you see where our bodies are executed? Yeah. Might be worth getting close to those and checking them out. That's not a bad idea. That is a good idea. I did see it earlier, but... Oh, yeah, there it is. 11Ks. Let's go. Agrid's over that way, too, so that's a good sign. Yeah, it's taken me... The I've value target took me to our um corpses yep you got any targets yet Agrid, or not okay. Damn. all right might be time to start doing some scans Sandgraver and X. Yeah, I can see me in Sandgraver. Oh, I can even see the Reclaimer. Nice. Oh, the Redeemer. God damn it. Too many names in this game that are just too close in sound. It's only going to get worse. Oh, yeah. I have no doubt. I love the way there's so many ships named after one single Roman sword. Hmm. All right, what do you guys think we should do? Have a look around? How many or... ships are you looking for? Uh, I think I got zipped down to only a couple, didn't you, Agrid? Yeah, well, let's have a look. But, uh, again, track the mission. Uh, my tracking says nothing, so... Did we complete the mission then? Yeah, is it is it in your... His... Check your history and see if it's completed. We might be able to grab another one for you, if that's the case. We can go on to the next one. No, nope, it wants me to restart it. Oh, then restart That's it. That's all right. Man. Just restart it, mate. Got plenty of us now to smash you through it, so that's oh. good. Restart it? Yep. Um, I'm going to quickly flow back to Seraphim and repair this real quick. I would be right near Grim. I've already got Seraphim locked, though. Okay, perfect. <laughs> I wasn't sure of the lost sight lines. Yeah, I would have gone grim if it was available. Just 
Just let us know where it is, Zachary, and we'll start moving. Um, I'll look at the map. It is kind of surprising they didn't put it in the text, to be honest, um, of the, the mission itself. Honestly, it's surprising it's not shareable. Yeah, that too. I think they underestimated how much people would enjoy just doing random sections of it once they finished. Yeah. Well, I did the first couple at least three or four times helping other people do it, so... Incursion yeah. site is Yola. Oh, okay. Well, you head yeah, there. Yeah, there's multiple locations around. Yeah, yeah you, you head to there, and then we'll all be able to walk to you, our grid. So you just let us know when we're there, and we'll come. Yeah. And just don't move in until we get a couple of us there. Then we'll be right. We'll be a couple of minutes, so, because we're going to repair this. Yeah, I'm really curious what they do with the tally. I hope they put a little crew area in it, um, like an AOX type, you know, where there's more than one seat for people to do things. And maybe make the the useless turrets, because there's a couple of good turrets on the tally, but a couple of useless ones as well. Yeah. I, I, and if I, those I, are I, remote, I, I, we'd just clean it up. I, I'm like, you can cross your fingers for stuff like that, but I'm. There's not a lot of space in that thing, so my my brain is like, I, like I don't want to get too hopeful. Um, yeah, there's no space because of all the corridors to every oh, single part. No one saw that execute. No one saw no, that. Nobody, no, nobody at all. That's all fine. No, I just, <laughs> I was just. You're missing that wing to start with. Yeah, yeah. That's okay. You know, this is going up on Tuesday. Yeah. Well, it's just a consequence of a damaged ship. You're fine. Um, Just remember, any any landing you walk away from is a good one. Well, we didn't crash. Indeed. We just we just rolled. So yeah. We're unable to repair my end. You might want to try again. I'm repaired. Ah, perfect. It's already fully repaired. Um, reopening doors. Yeah, the tally was designed before they had remote turret technology. Like yeah. they, it just wasn't a thing. Well, if you guys remember back, the original Retaliate actually had animations to go through the turrets after they were blown off. Like, that's how old that thing is. We don't yeah, have that I, anymore. I do remember. Yeah. I remember. Also, yeah. I also wanted it to be like a B-17, you know, so... I know, I get it. But then they, they went, let's make it like a submarine, was the theory, was the, the feel they went for when they remade it. Yep. Yeah, so they had to do... I'd, if I was sticking with the B-17 idea, I'd like them to put the bombardier... In the nose. I think they've gone to the submarine though because it's torpedoes, not bombers. You know. Yeah. No, but that's the Polaris is the submarine. The yeah. um, retaliator yeah, is the, the bomber. The retaliator is basically. No, I, I would say the bomber's the A two now and the A one. That's my whole point. Yeah, good, good call. Yes, the visual aesthetics of the retaliator are. Um, it's a B two bomber. Visually, it's it's modelled on the USB two. Yeah. Guns wise, they modeled it on a B seventeen. Right, where's that? And it's like so. Yeah, it, it's a little all over the map. It's, the it's... main one with the corridors is that's what takes all of the space in the ship. Yeah. So they don't have a really good engineering space in the Retaliator. No. If they knock out those aft corridors to and made them remote guns, they'd be able to have a much better engineering space. Agreed. Because it's it's a multi crew ship that doesn't do very nice multi crew things. That's yeah. right. The multi crew ship it doesn't really have multi crew gameplay. And that's why I think yeah. that, I think that just leads into what I was saying before about reducing the crew requirements. Are you yeah. guys all at Grim or is this on a? No, this is the mission site. We've got three at mission. All right, head in. We're, we're, and myself. Yeah, we're right behind you. We're coming in now. Good to start when mm. you guys are. I'm just cruising slowly in towards yep. the uh, incursion site. You know what that means. I would suggest you know what that, that means. Aren't fine. Sangram, Maybe you know what that means, right? We're all going to die. No, it means I've got to fly past him really fast. Okay. I would suggest if you're not one of the tallies or eclipses, don't target the hammerheads with missiles because they're probably being shot at torps. Well, we're definitely in the area because I'm getting trespassing stuff. Algrid, have you got the trespass notification? I've got it. I got it just yeah, yeah, just but... as I got to that big rock. 
But I'm still 26.2 kilometers out because I was waiting for you. Copy. All right, Roger. So I'm assuming it's over there on that scan, unless I'm mistaken. Now I've got the first pass. Yep. <laughs> How do I rotate my targets on getting? Uh, T and five, five, I think cycles. T targets the one that's under your crosshair from memory. Yeah. Some memory you'll, you'll always pick up the hammerheads from about 15 k's out, so they'll be your first ones you see. Yeah, I think I just picked up all you guys. Low right. I see a marker to the right. Yeah, combat going go go right. Mm, we don't have one yet, but you guys. Hey, do we want to support Albert? Saying he'll be. Um... Yeah, well, well, he's got the equipment. He's the one who needs the mission. He's yep. gonna, he's gonna shit the crap out of the hammerhead. Head, I'm pretty sure I know him. I haven't got any targets yet. Yeah. Well, you should have one hammerhead low right. I don't towards have the towards the moon. Recon uh, by five. Yeah, I see it. Moving in. Then Galo, is that the guy you're talking about? And yeah, it's yep. him ahead. Yep, go I'm for that guy. Yep, target is one. You want me to say hello? It yeah, won't get through go, shields. Go ahead. Go ahead. You do. Firing you. one. Yep. Multiple targets appeared now. Are you we'll going for the hammerhead? We'll target. No, no, nah, nah, we'll target the small Sports crew. Yep, got it. Good. They, they've got all the torps. So I'll let them just take him out. All right, tight fire. Oh, they should be dead. This one. Oh, not the top one. This one. one I'm on. Yep. No, I was going for a gladius near it. Oh, it's Roger not. Sorry. It's all good. I'm super paranoid about crashing into a rock right here. That's all right. Uh, what are we on there? Fill this guy off. What's recharging, that recharging. He's on fire, this one. Yep. There he goes. Well, we'll dodge that. Thank you very much. Target to our rear. Uh, target. Just give me a name. Yeah, I'm following. Yep, yep. With you. Rolling. Mm -hmm. Nice. That was nice. Very nice. Boom. Uh, what about that? What's that? The hammerhead? Yeah. Do no, not soft. Right. Yeah, no. it's just destroy. That's a colorless yeah. job. Uh, what about uh, Gladius? That's, that's... Yeah, we're going to miss on us too. Is that Algrid? Algrid's that's red for some reason. I don't know why, but he is. Shut up as an enemy. Just be careful. He's pulling my screen. Just careful. It's all right. We're checking our targets. Yep. We're not shooting him. We'll just mark him as yeah, four. No, three. Yeah, there we go. It's marked as three. All right. I can't see any more. Uh, There's one. Oh, wait. One. No, that's Lady Grace is an enemy as well. What the fuck? <laughs> yeah, are, you're are, we are we Lady done, Algrid, or not? Have we, have we finished the mission? Uh... Ethnification is asking for a friend, so that let me check. There should be a lot more on the Again, if you if you track it on your screen, it'll literally disappear. That that way you know it's done. Out of uh, seven or twenty-four. The enemy cutlass black next to me. So right, uh, come on. Come on. Yep, we got it. Yeah, I'm only seeing you as an enemy or lady grace. That's all right, we've got it. Yeah, that's all right, you know not to shoot me yet. You just check your names, mm -hmm. just check your targets, essentially, you'll be fine. It's, someone sh just shot me. Uh, target them and see if they're an enemy, I guess. Dog. I had a second one. See just... someone? Someone just torpedoed you, you got a torpedo flying around your calls. No, I can only see you over there, Lady Grace. I can't see anyone else. That was black, nine kilometers front. All Four right. others with it. All right, I'll just keep okay, going. Okay, that's a cluster. Yep. So it's down, like like down, I guess, is from the rings, is it? Because you seem to be heading down. Yeah. Oh yeah. I think we just got down. one. Yeah. Is that it? There. Yep. That's a soft death something. There we go. Uh, whole other, cluster. Yeah, whole cluster. Here. That's why. That's why. All right, we might get shot by other people. Be careful. All right. Yeah. Okay. Is that an enemy? I don't have a tag. It's a hostile. Oh. Yeah, but if it's a player, that's not going to end. It's well. a hostile IR. All right, Roger. All right, she's dead. Uh, low front. Yep, with low, just come. 
Yep, yep. Turning. General Lederman? That sounds like a player. No? That's two names, though. It's two, oh, it's yeah, double, true. true, double true. Yep, yeah, going. TK's out, going. I think, I think it's 1.8. That would be a good way to troll people. Yeah, 1.8. Yeah, it would. It really would. Out of range. Out of range. Yeah. Uh, close, close to targets, maybe. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm yeah. going at him. He's just... Uh... Oh, we got the trespassing thing back now. That was really weird. Gone. Two targets just behind us, the way we came, execute. That is, yep. Yeah, every, nice. Everyone's bleeding me. Even, even, even the, the name things are bleeding me at the moment. Trent Wayland? Oh, that's a... Yep, I'll start. Yeah. Three Ks. Yeah, he's through to me. Target. Yeah, well, he's right. I think our Garrett's a bit sus then. Yep, yeah, he looks pretty sus to me. I've always thought that though. Uh, what do we have now, Algrid? We're done? Awarded. Nice, cool. Nice. Grab, this, grab the next one. Everyone get out. So you don't get past. I'm going to head to uh, the top of yellow. It's going to walk up to that top part. Nice work, people. Yeah, good job. Very smooth. Did lose anyone? I don't think we really took damage. No. Okay. I think my pain like only got scratched by friendly fire. Yeah, I think it's like many hands make like work type of thing. So... <laughs> and uh, please orientate towards the planet and marvel at the amazing view. Mm. Because goddamn, that's pretty. Mm -hmm. It is. I don't know if you remember the old no, because it's not giving uh, Crusader, but that's so much nicer. Uh, it'll be under priority, Argrid, if you go under priority. Yeah, no. That's what I said. There's no priority. Oh, okay, it just turned up. It does take a minute from memory, but yeah. Someone called Malcolm Den says hello to execute an algorithm in, in global on the server. Uh, Malcolm Den. In Second, they just might recognize the names from your streaming. Possible. Possible. Man, that was a bit of a delay. That is a little bit of a delay. That is delay. All right, where have I got to go? Just make sure you're tracking it this time, too, please. I'm not tracking it. What's going on there? Okay. That's not normal. QT has been a pain since they released this. No, this, um, like it's not following my mouse. And it look, that's not oh, okay. It's not Q. What the hell is going on? Uh I'm gonna try to turn it off on it again. Nope. Hmm. Hit a key. I don't know what if hit. I'm gonna get out. And get back in. If that doesn't work, I can always take over pilot. Yeah, I, no, I've hit a key. That's what it is. I've turned on some mode by hitting something or something. What is it? Uh, there's the bottom. Well, that's about safe as well. Sorry, um, whoever spoke then, I'm having trouble hearing you a bit muffled. Oh, sorry, expat brats here as well. Oh, hey, expat. in the server. Yeah, expat. Is she in on Discord or not? Nope. Just join this. Join my Discord expert if you want to come and chat. You've got our Discord. Ah, oh, sir. <laughs> Mate, I'll give her an invite if, she, if she's on the server. Excellent. She is. I swear she's stalking all the Australian the streamers it's, at the moment. It's fine. She does the same thing I do. She likes to get around and visit everyone. I'm the same. I'm off in her head. She was motivating Jen last night. Is that what she calls it? Oh, okay. Yeah, Alright, where are we heading now, Grid? At yellow. Still at yellow? Oh, wow. Oh, nice. That's, you got very lucky, mate. Are we heading to you, I assume? Uh, I'll jump to the incursion site. Roger. 149 kilometers from me. Yep, Roger, Roger. I'll just mark you then. And we'll head just start with robotic body voice. That's fine, just a bit of lag. All right, we got your tracks when you're ready. Mm. 
Yes, it is a bit of a night shift. Sorry we're not reading chat, because this is a gameplay one. So again, if we're missing any of your questions, that I do apologize. But like it's one of the reasons why we don't do um gameplay and answer your questions on the on the regular streams because we just can't pay attention to both. So this time yeah. around we're we're just you know, we're we're just playing, which is not something we normally do, so um yeah. Are you at the uh, uh, location of it or not? I'm not, I'm not sure. I think he's just jumped. Not a good crane. We're going to get a game exactly. Found that couldn't do that and play at the same time. Mm. Are you are you at the location, oh, Agrid, or not? Sorry, yeah. Yeah, yeah well, cool. twenty six point two kilometers away. Yep. I'm going nice and slow. I'll walk to you uh, to to you guys now then. Going nice and slow, so you guys can come in and kill them all. Expat, if you're watching the stream, come join us. On Discord. Well, she's in the she's in the game. Yeah. She's just she's server. Probably doing work or something though, you know, on her too. Always busy. Hey guys. Hey. hey buddy. Hey Mal. Just wanted wanted to say a big thanks for that was that was really awesome. Thanks. I didn't expect you guys to pop in and help us out. Cheers. Oh, that was amazing. We weren't there for you, we were there. <laughs> we're helping our grid do the overdrive. That's right. Oh, I was just you have to do in this area, we. All oh, right. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. What do you do? Sorry, guys. Just from ice. So, what were you guys doing? They're doing the same thing. All right. Yeah, yeah. We're doing the same thing, and you guys showed up and obliterated some of our targets. So I was like, Red was like, "Oh, it's execute." And I was like, "Execute? Surely it's not the execute." Now look, it is the execute, and I mm. saw our grid, and then oh my god, thanks guys, it was so <laughs> awesome. Oh, well, we try. Yeah, yeah, we turned up deliberately to help you. That's what it was. Like, <laughs> we helped ourselves. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck it. Oh, that was funny. That was awesome. So have you finished yours now, or? Uh... Oh, we still got a no, few we're... more to go. Well, we're but... at one now. Yeah, well, that was the stage one. Oh, well, um, I was literally talking about the Redeemer uh, with my mate, Red, and it's it's a very capable ship. Two people take out a whole Xeno threat mission out is insane. So target the, yeah. target the Gladius first. Cluster of five at execute. Yeah, we're in fire we're in combat right now. Uh Red, where we're heading. Whoa, he tried uh, to ram. I'm just gonna restock. Oh, yeah. Target two you... cutlass. Target two cutlass. But you guys, we just wanted to come in and say a quick thanks. So much appreciate. Yeah, thank you, guys. And, you're, you're welcome to stay and join us, Mal, if you want. We can get you a but, group invite and you can come join us. Yeah, for sure, man. All, we, all we're doing uh, is pushing our group for getting caught up with overdrive. That's all we're doing. Because he's just a bit behind. Yeah. Overheated. Yep, so. Red, it's up to you, man. Do you, want, do you want to stay here or do you want to go back to our Discord? What, what do you want to do, mate? Uh, yeah, I'm down. Well, we're doing the overdrive, so if you want to do it, like many hands make light work, we're just going to fly through it because there's so many of us helping. Yeah, I'm happy to stay too. Right. Yeah, have a head. Yeah. But I'm out of it. I'm out of ordnance. Roger. Just Go back and re oh, I'll just stay around until we get it killed then, Angrid. Anyway, we're incoming. I think I avoided. Right, another one. Yeah. Uh, at the torpedo took down the hammer here. Nice. And I'll try and get you an invite in a second. Uh, I might just go out of combat here for a second so I can get him an invite. Algar, do you want to jump out onto the tally? Okay. All right, invite, oh, invite coming for you, Mal. Hold on. Uh, Mal, 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 Mal. Hey, expat. Sneaking into Discord. And who's the other one? Red. Sneaky snake. Red, yeah. Hey, expat mate. Good to see you, mate. Hey. Oh. So, what was your friend's name? Hello, everybody. What was your friend's name? Mal? Was it? Uh, red. Red. Hang on, I'm red. We're under attack again. Give me a second. Good old Red. I just can't go wrong with Red, you know. <laughs> Something just rammed me. Cheers, mate. <laughs> I know that the bloody rammed the shit out of you. Don't those bloody gladiuses? Mm. Got to take them out. I think it was yeah, a gladius. Mate. I do think it was a gladius. Yeah, I we, saw it in the corner of my eye. We almost got ran by one too. We got. I, I cannot see anyone called Red on. Or, I, I see Rodite <laughs> and Rump Angel. I do not see a Red on the on the. Uh... Oh, it's okay. Red underscore Red. Uh, it's L underscore Red 
underscore L. L. Okay, looking for L. Execute your traveling at speed through an asteroid field. Uh, well, I can't see Just the letting, guy. You know. Yeah, I can't see the guy's name. Yeah, oh, but you're, you're, you're making... Can you um... a question regarding... Um... Oh, sorry, Albert, you go. I was just going to say, you're, you're driving a sand groper, making him scared because you're going at speed for an asteroid field. Sorry. To, to, answer your, uh, to answer your question regarding uh, the Australian streamers, it just so happens that you all stream at a really nice time for me, which is just in the afternoon, afternoon coffee. Mm. Ah, oh, that's perfect. Good. So, uh... Of course. Fantastic. Oh, you, we, we like to accommodate for, the, for those. Mm. How many got left out on you. the uh, track? <laughs> <laughs> so, hey, uh, speaking of accommodating, can someone get these photos off me? Yeah, we're coming. Uh, who, is that you, Jez? Oops. Yeah, I'm, I'm working at the moment. I've got one. That's Lady Grace. Needs support. Uh, got, got, I got fleas. Six Ks. We're close. Yeah, I'm heading for that J sprinkler off that's on her tail. Oh, there's a closer target than that one. Yeah, I'm going to go straight past Anders. All right, speeding up. We're in range now. Take him. Shot it can't be much closer because it's literally shooting her. <laughs> oh, it's more the, the lighting for seeing the target. Was well, that's a hammer into the sun. All right, so the, and then there's the small one there. Wait, trying to get the, that one. Ooh. Yeah, I can see it now. Yeah, I got two gladiators. Uh, uh, Chasing going. back to you. Yeah, we're being. Yes. We got hit. We lost the right. back wing. We, don't Again. Need we lost both wings. <laughs> Yep. Red God, yeah, missiles. Up. Flares just do not work in this build at the moment. I had the same problem yesterday. It was always missiles that got me. Flares are just not working. My clips got taken out by a, by a gladius that blew into me. Yep. 12 this is, why, yeah, this is kind of why I want you in another ship with other people, so you're less likely to die. I think uh, we're all good to go, Red. What do you reckon, mate? It doesn't let me repair. Can you jump in the pilot seat and try? No, it says no service required. It's all it's all good. I've, I've covered us. It's just I refueling just, hydrogen now. I just managed to kill five of them by kiting them into an asteroid. It was magical. Wow, oh, nice. Well done. <laughs> that, like the skill. old uh, Han Solo in the asteroid field trick. Yeah. Execute yeah. torpedo on the, the way to the heavy head with you. <laughs> yeah. All right, just be aware of comms now, guys, because we do have a lot of people in here now. So just... um. Essential only now. Comic relief is fine though, because that's essential. We right. don't have shields to execute. No, I know. We are probably going to die a horrible, horrible death. I'm trying my best to be. My area has been sanitized. Pixie break, right? Feels I'm so glad I've, I got the uh, box of beers just in case. You never know. Hello, Hemi Hemi Catch. There is actually a part in the, uh, in, in the manual regarding uh, beer and flying. Um, it is actually approved in certain circumstances. Oh, but we have alcohol every day. It's yeah. it's what we do here in Australia. Yeah. Nice. Was that a talk? That was perfect. I think that was a talk, was that? <laughs> yes. That, that was, that's what happens when other people take down the rear shields yeah. and the retaliator gets behind. Nice. Okay. Well done. That was really nice. <laughs> Good teamwork makes the dream work. Al Garrett. Yeah, well, you guys are taking shields out. So is that everything? Trouble. Algrid, is that everything? Oh, Al Garrett, we missed that. Is that every okay. target now? I just said one to go. One to go. Okay. One to go. Oh, shit. Okay, look, we didn't leave. Yeah. Time to explore the uh, asteroid field. <sighs> so I hope they weren't left where I was because I was like. Oh, uh, okay. Glad he is. Eight okay. kilometers. Uh, six kilometers ahead of me. Uh, yep. Find Lady Grace, we'll follow her. Where Wait, is... Do you need a mission? Uh, not not quite yet. Well, actually, Albert, can you share yours with, if you try, oh, try clicking... That'd be great. Are they in our group yet? Yes, they are yeah, in our group. I'll share so, it. So, I know, Albert's got it. Albert, please share this before, we kill, before we kill the last one. Don't kill the last one. Do not kill the last one. Stop. Okay. Pulling off. Yeah. Albert, running away. please share quick. Uh, unable to share. Ah, too bad then. Yeah. All right, just kill it. That's okay. Thanks, guys. Appreciate it. We can always have to do it. This means, me, this means we're going to do it another one. That's all. The next series of missions are shareable, but yeah. this one, killing the uh, clusters, it's you've only can have it if you've seen. Well, it. if you actually got to the location, if we hold off until you got here and you already had this, oh no, but it might be in a different location, wouldn't it? 
It doesn't matter. We can kill more ships. I mean, yeah. All right. There the we go. Is that it done? Is that it's done, Hagrid? Can't tell you at the moment because I'm putting on a uh, undersuit, so I can actually fly. Mate, I fly naked. It's great. You, you should, should try it. You should still be able to go in your mega glass and see if it's been done. Oh, well, I'm in the inventory. Oh, oh, red. We're good to go, mate. Yeah. Get a nice little pull off to that right hand side where the, the wing in the fire is showing. Um, Lady Grace. Mm -hmm. Oh, I just saw your name tag there. I was just saying hi. Sorry. Well, you could always get out of that thing and use the top tower. Keys the demon. Mr. Red. Something yeah. happened. It says I abandoned the mission, but I, I'm pretty sure I didn't. Uh, um, if you have the same mission as someone else and you haven't got to the location, then when it completes, it abandons. Mm. All that means is look for the mission again and take it again. Ah, okay. Thanks. Let's buff this out, huh? Yeah, it's a really weird it, mission it, design it, it, because you can't it, share it, it. It's really interesting how damaged this hurricane is, yet I just take the little wing off the back of the Reclaimer, oh, the Redeemer, sorry, and it costs like 4K. It costs less than 4K to this whole ship. That's ridiculous. And the handling of the ship doesn't change much when it's damaged. It's brilliant. No. It's a gorgeous little ship. Oh, oh, it's, these, it's also because the Redeemer's have... been nerfed to high heaven as well, let's be honest. Yeah, Redeemer, you get, if you get rammed on the, the side engines, you lose lateral control. Yeah, you do, actually. Even I'm if it's not even red. Well, some, we... Oh, so it's, it kind of suffers the same penalties that the uh, Defender has. Yes. Yeah, there's a claw and and you lose all your all your controls as well. Yeah. So does anyone have this stage of the mission left to do before we move to the next tier? Yep. I think Agrid's only on two or three, isn't he? Or... Oh, okay. Okay, I thought Agrid was on the third one then. No, perfect. I think Red's on stage yeah, three. Head again Second. first in space now. If uh, you would like me to return you to the fleet, sir. I have a retaliator about to take off. Ah, perfect. I shall oh, escort you. Oh, okay. Outstanding. Lovely, lovely to have some uh, advocacy. Uh... Execute, do you think you'd be able to jump us to our bodies before it gets here? Sure. Then, do you have yeah, a tractor beam to pick them up? Or? Uh, I was just thinking about looting the armor off them, to be honest, because yeah. I've got some tiger claws in there, I think, which we may need for the next tier. Yeah, Roger. Um... The other thing is I could just go get a cutter and we could go out and pick him up. We've got time. He's going to be 10 minutes getting here. Oh, we can EBA. We can do it in this. Um, <laughs> but then we can actually just... I'm thinking just pick the tractor beam up off the body and then off one of the bodies and then pull the bodies in the back and then just switch everything okay. over. Sure. Um, but the other thing is I can just, like, do you have a cutter? I was going to say, well, you could fly this. I'll take the cutter. I'll collect the bodies. You come over, yep, switch sure. over, and we abandon the cutter. How about we do that, then? Yeah, we'll do We'll do that. That sounds good. Yeah, that'll speed it up. Um, well done. I, I want to go there as well in a, in a Redeemer. I, I'm already in the Redeemer, so if you want, you can... Yeah, bring one. Or the Marriott. the bodies. Or the Marriott. Uh, you Just fly back to the location here, if you can, because I don't see the marker. Thanks, Red. You won't be able to land in one of these hangars, execute, or I won't be able to take no, off. No, no. Is that one's already destroyed, I think? Yep. Hold on. Okay. If you land, I won't be able to open the hangar doors. Hang on. Oh, I know what you're doing now. Get out. Yep, I am. Please. Is that one a hammerhead? No. That one is. This one is. 
I've got to be careful of friendly fire now. Yep. Chief, do you want people jumping to you? No, we we don't stream often like this, Chris. Like basically yeah. never. But it's going to be more more and more common as the game. Oh, is on. this live? This is live. Oh, this is fantastic. Yeah. But we don't normally. Oh, shish! I didn't. Can I, I have to call it. Hang it. Hang it. Doors are opening. Yeah, that's it, okay. Go, live, go but we're it. also going to release it on Tuesday as our bid because yeah. we're lazy. We just can't be bothered doing a show this week. This it's just. I don't know if you guys have noticed, but it's probably been the the single besides Citizen Con, it has easily been the sing assault like quiet period. We basically had nothing mm -hmm. from Invictus to Citizen Con. We've now had Citizen Con, and then we had a three month break. Then we had every ISC is literally just been more shit that was at Citizen Con. So exactly. Yeah. Um, and and I'm a little bit tapped as is our grid of trying to make original content because it just hasn't been anything solid and and, and, and it. And everything we kind of want to talk about, we just don't quite have enough information to talk about it. Um, well, I, yeah. I also think, like, I don't know about you, but I'm I'm still feeling. So. Yeah, I'm a little bit under the weather too, if if that's what you're uh, implying. But yes, I am, just a little. I really like the episode you, you talked about. What you wish, um, Star Citizen could improve on, no, like your your know. negatives. Oh, the regrets. Yeah, that we yeah. recorded that before we went to hospital, and everyone's going, "Oh, you guys recovered so well." It's like, yeah, because I haven't got sick yet. Um, yeah. Party <laughs> invite requested in local. Oh, fuck it all. That's funny. Uh, execute. Guess what? We've lost our death markers for our bodies. Uh, yeah. Do you, want, do you want me to come back and pick you up? Where are the death markers? Uh, don't you have to be within range of them or some shit? No, you uh, always... It's a time thing as well. Yeah. Well, shit. Um, yeah, I'll come back and yell. Yeah, I'll come and transfer over. Hold on. Well, I can go on the turret for a bit for something different if you want. No, no, you uh, can fly. No, that's cool. I don't mind. I'm easy. Nice. Good flying there, Red. Thanks. Who's calling? Uh, ethnification is after a party invite. Hey, Red. I've run out of ammo. Yeah. I'm heading towards the back turret now, just to let you know. All right. All right, mate. Invite sent. I happen to see the chat because it just happened to still be up. Yep. So good. Oh, I fell over. All right, where are we going this time? Well, you're the one navigating, so if you don't know, yeah. I'd be scared. I'm right here at yellow, yellow uh, execute. I'm just on the pads outside the external one. I've got our body markers, by the way, and I'm, oh, okay, I'll head to you then. Um, one thousand two hundred kilometers away, but I do have them. Um, but I think we have to manually fly there. This is somewhere Sorry. fairly close. Let me have a look. I think when we last did it was only about two hundred k's, which isn't that far. Yeah, but we don't have that marker anymore. Um, yep. So where are you? You're there. I'm here. It's over there near Malcolm. Malcolm, are you still there? Yeah, I'll mate. We're still here. I'll see if I can walk to Malcolm. He seems a lot closer to it than... Oh, shit. I've ran out of ammo on this one. Sorry for my language, guys. I do apologize for swearing. Don't I know it's not it. professional. I swear all the fucking Malcolm, are you in combat? Yeah. Um, is, is it um, um, we wouldn't mind. All right, guys, I'm, gonna, I'm just going to be rude again and call it. There is a lot of over chatter, so try to cut it back a little bit, please, because it gets very Will do. distracting to listen to if you're a viewer. Just gonna Sorry, mate. No, 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 no one's fault. Just cross the board. Doesn't mean go dead quiet. It just means. <laughs> yeah, no. I'll only communicate if it's something urgent. Yep. All right, so I'm 573 from the bodies now. Um, uh, I can see the marker now. Yeah. Seven hundred. Well, I'll just just Not let sure. me fly there, and you can catch up if you want. So, wait, no point both of us flying that flying there, slow mo. 
Oh shit, I got contacts. Wait, they're Malcolm's contacts. Yeah. That's, That's our next uh, point two. Little ships head Malcolm. Yeah, we'll meet we'll meet there in a sec. Wait, so you you you've got the same marker as Malcolm, really? Nice. Yeah. Well, that's yeah, there's two uh, markers in the same area. Nice. Execute. I'm 270 yeah, k's away I, from our bodies. I, I see you. How are we doing, Red? Okay, I'm about, about to jump to. Yeah, we're good. One expert. I'm out of ammo. I'm ballistics. Uh, say again, Algert. Say again. Going to orbital orbital marker one. Copy. On the way. Is that Hammerhead? No, that Hammerhead's not down. Yeah, he's not down. Okay. Put me our way. So which card is that? Execute? Just the default one? Uh, this is the one that came with the white skin, yeah, just the default one. I, I'm going to be honest, I, I really hate the Rambler. Like, I just... Nice. Yeah, I just I just wasn't happy with how it came out. Like, it's meant to be the advanced starter, but it's actually crappier than the default. And the Scout, I think, will have a place eventually, but it just... Yeah, not at the moment. I can go ahead and finish that mission, because it just got withdrawn. Oh, you guys finished it. Oh, well. Well, now they've got... Now, you execute? now they've got two done. If you guys... If one of you guys pick it up, you should be able to share it with the other, and we can all move on to the third one together. So that means everyone's up at the same place. Yeah. So that's fine. So just wait till another one comes up, and whoever whoever gets it first, share it with. Uh, so Mal, share it with Algrid, or Algrid, share it with Mal. Yeah, Algrid, I've got medical support off your left wing. If you want to uh, set your spawn here, it'll stop you from uh, being so far when you die. If you die, you'll never die. So you're suggesting I hop out and get in and take some medical uh, mapping, huh? Yeah, it might be an idea, and then I'll stay. Uh, I'll stay on location, and uh, I'm sure there'll be plenty of ships for you to jump in, just in case. Oh, Roger that. I will do that. Not that it. Not that it makes any difference because I'm only in my yellow, my white gear at the moment. I think she means you mean you. It means you don't have to come all the way back from Everest, is what she's saying. Yeah, I know. I know exactly what she's saying. Doesn't work. All right, guys. I got me. another mission, but I cannot. Uh, it wouldn't let me share it. Okay. All right. Maybe wait and see which one Algo gets to then, and hopefully you get the same. I recommend entry through the uh, the roof. It will be easier, I believe. As soon as I find you. There you are. Execute Sangro for 75 k's out. You might be able to QT to me from our bodies. Roger. Uh... How good? What ship are you trying to um, enter? Uh, a gorgeous ship, I'm looking. Nice. You'll see the two doors. I'm here. 39 out. Yep. I just got to go to your um, first aid room. Got to remember where it is. Very rarely enter uh, the. Medical uh... is available on the habitation deck. Yeah, just got to remember where it is from, from entering the ship at this point. Uh, uh -huh. I'm guessing. I'm, uh, en route. Nice. Sorry, Red. Uh, I think we're repairing. Yes. Oh, there it is. Nice. Welcome aboard, sir. Oh, thank you. Thank you, ma'am. It's a shame you're not streaming X Pack because then we could have like, multi like a multi stream going or something. That would have been cool. I haven't done that yet. I do want to do that at one point. Get some people together and do some multi streaming. Just go to all get together for for a party on a big massive eight ninety jump, you know. Oh well, they had that experience yeah. thing, didn't they? But it got uh, this hijacked this by Greeper. I got invited to did. that. <laughs> well, I got invited to it, but I was like, yeah, this is going to get ruined. I, I saw it coming. Yeah. You're doing something like that. You actually want to have escorts and security. 
Yeah. That's I, it. I think they're going to try it again, though, aren't they, expat? Um, I know they're done. Oh, really? Yeah, they got griefed off of uh, Star Citizen. Damn, that's unfortunate. That's why um, that's why CIG uh, put out a pretty strong statement on the matter. Damn, that's unf- that's really sad that people would push people out of a community. Yeah, would do that, wouldn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Whoa! No! 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 This is gonna end bad. Whoa! Should I be afraid? I'm in EVA out here. Oh, I always fly reckless. You should see the time I landed a, ca- a caterpillar with piggles and stuff. Space to mother, they were having chickens. <laughs> Like laying eggs because they were panicking so much. All right, we get the back out there. So that's your nice. body. That's my body. If I just rotate this around here. Just gotta try and rearm. Red. Something like. Got it. Yeah, thanks. This, and then cut engines. Set to the uh, the data assist medical be what? Processing. Except for the, uh, your wonderful ship. Someone's moving a bunch nice. of plates and bowls around. <laughs> it's like we're washing up or something. Um, 44 well, meters. I do notice a bit of lag. Are you getting your own body? Um, yeah, I've grabbed my own body. Yep, cool. You want to dump it in the back? Or... No. Yeah, I'm going to strip down and grab what's there. Just want no, no, I want to grab I just want that. that, thanks. And then... This one. Do that. And that. And that. Put your butt over here, you. You lazy little bitch. I didn't. Whoa. I see you like the casual approach there, uh, expat. Yeah, apologies for the casual James, appearance. James uh, it's it. actually a day off. You're doing Still. barrels again, expat. No, she was putting clothes under armor. I've never seen someone get so excited about clothing in my entire life. It was hilarious. Ooh. I loved it. Okay. Oh, well, well you know. Yeah, it's not technically possible currently. <laughs> Yeah, it was, it was still. Oh, you know, you, you've watch. got a helmet with your uh, clothes, so that's impressive. Exactly. I can actually EVA like this and everything. Okay, I'll put it with that. And then put you back on here. And I am done. Right, that wasn't it? Um, no, wrong one. You don't need you anymore. Oh. Get out of my shit, piece of Not garbage. Fun. That was a hanger. Sorry. I just watched you throw sand out the back oh, of your ship. It was amusing. Fly away with me. Yeah. I believe there's someone called Hollington looking for an invite to the yep. party. Execute. I'll, I'll get him. Give me a second. I'll jump in the pilot seat if you want to do Gunner. Then get you a bit more time for that. Yeah. Whereabouts? Well, that would be helpful because it was it was distracting last time. Yeah. But that's fine. Yeah, it's the nature, that. nature of the content creator. Uh, I'm sure there's a few of us here that can relate to that. So I usually get assistance or where's PC when we need him. That's all we need. We need PC here. Um... <laughs> Is anyone at one of those missions at the moment? The uh, fleet battles. Right. Negative. All right. I'll get him in uh, Huntington. Give me a second. Uh... Just checking. Is anyone in chat at one of those fleet battles for us to start jumping to them? I do have one. It's a Hurston. We're on our way. Hey, Me and Malcolm. Hollington. There he goes. Algrid, where's your fleet battle mission? Is that also at Hurston? I can't. Uh, no, mine was it. Uh, I have to check. I haven't clicked it up yet. Sorry. Good, good when you are, Sandra. Yep, I'm just waiting till we confirm where we're going. I just said. Welcome, the... Hollington. Head to the uh, marker up the top of the planet. Saves time. Let me get in the bloody ship, you piece of poo. Just say it, Algrid. Piece he, of shit. He, he's getting, he's, he gets grumpier and grumpier the tired he gets. Stop. <laughs> I'm the same. I'm exact same. We And we know, or we can look at the other one and kind of go, we're grumpy. Well, like, we know, we know who the other's going to be. We've done it that long, so yeah, it's funny. Uh, it's okay. Yeah. I'm going to have a bit of fruitcake. Oh, because I'm feeling pretty nice. I keep a stash of frozen chocolate cake in the freezer in just individual slices. Uh, I, I'm not even meant to have fruit cake, but this is like my sugar intake for the day. This is like all I have because I'm diabetic. I'm not meant to have any. 
a couple of slices of fruit cake. That's my uh, guilty pleasure. So this is an issue the Italiator has. Mm -hmm. Getting back in via Eva, because it doesn't let you. Yeah, that's kind of the same with the F8C. You have to position your character in a particular way. Yeah. Can, uh, it, can anyone see like the robot face here, like it's a Decepticon or something, if you're looking at the stream? It only took several attempts. Uh, yes. Is it good? The eyes even glow. Wow. <laughs> Transformers. When did warp then? I'm taking the gamble that um, Al Garrett's mission is around Hurston. Right. I would um, I would say that's a good gamble. Yep. Because at least this at least this way we're starting the QT trip there. Yeah. yeah before true. Al Garrett tells us where the oh, mission is. Appreciate it. Thank you know what we sh we should have done is we should have gone to Horizon and upgraded the drive on this one. Oh, you guys are flying the um, Hurricane, right? Mm -hmm. Nice. Yeah. Actually, um, brought the skin for um, just off Pete last week because he has that shitty blue one. And so I like he, it. Now he's got to wear this red one. Oh, this one's always for sale, though, isn't it? Geez, I thought it crashed then for a second. My sound cut out and everything. The hurricane was such a silent sleeper ship for people. It was like no, everyone forgot about how good it was. Oh, sorry. Commander says the mission is Magda, guys. Mission is Magda. Roger, thank you. Sorry, you were saying, um, Sangrove? Well, everyone was treating it as a crap or a poor solo fighter, but people mm. were never using it as that two-seater. The only time it got at that second lease of life, uh, life was once we saw the um, Scorpius come in. Mm -hmm. And then okay. people realised just how good this was. Two-seater fighter. Like I can remember when it first came out, people were bagging it out, and I took it out with uh, well, one of the guys, and um, it was one of the best ships I'd flown. Most most enjoyable um, experience I'd had. I know things are going to change, but there are some still weird things about it too. Like the Hawk is actually, what is it, 90, 100 bucks. This is almost 200. Yet in game, the Hawk is more expensive to buy than this. Why? Why? I think that Hawk's going to be a bit of a silent ship as well. I think people oh, it's don't a lot of how useful it is. Yeah. I, it's, it, so I so I essentially buy the Hurricane, then I buy the Hawk every time. That my first two in-game purchases. Every patch. The, the the Hawk is for myself, and the Hurricane I always take out with other people who do stuff. It's just a lot of fun. We're about halfway there. Mm. The Hurricane is a wonderful ship to play around in. Oh, absolutely. I think one of the things people forget about with the Hawk is the windows where you can see down to the ground. So True. if you're doing a lot of low level stuff, it flies more like a helicopter because you've got the visibility to go with it. So that's it's a really cool ship at low levels. Mm. I can't wait to try it after the um, atmospheric flight model comes in. That's oh, going to change the game as well because how many ships are going to get gliding abilities and stuff, and others are just going to be flying bricks. Like, imagine yeah. the star fairer. Brick. I mean, you got like, say something like the Corsair with those huge ass wings, like it's just going to glide like a an eagle. I don't know. That thing's asymmetric, isn't it? Yeah, but again, still having big wings like that. Looks like Dan and Red are at our site. The retaliator should be pretty sure. You're actually daring to scan me next to uh, old man Hurston. Unbelievable. Yeah. Sorry? What was that? Uh, Hurston Security are scanning me at the moment. Can you believe it? Well, maybe they're concerned. Uh, ID numbers. Uh, maybe they're concerned about the pilot. The um, <laughs> uh, I've heard there's a Hurston in the, in the area, so they're, you know, they're just wanting to make sure things are okay. <laughs> <laughs> Got to look, uh, got to look Dylan Carrick in close proximity to a VIP. Reminds me of that T-shirt. Uh, look busy. Uh, Vader's coming. If you've ever seen that with the stormtroopers. Yeah. <laughs> There's quite a couple hammerheads here. All right. Have they fixed oh, the doing bug? well? Have they fixed the bug where this mission spawns stupid amounts of hammerheads? They just infinitely spawn with their support craft. Mm. 
don't, I don't know. It, but it sounds fun. I've, yeah. I came into the tail end of one of those battles. Nice. Um, but I've never seen the full incursion of it. That would have been interesting. Right, that's my free cake for today. I hope you enjoyed it. Yeah. Probably that's one of those cakes that last. Mm-hmm. Let's start, baby. One does me about five days. Oh. Yes, Chris, I believe the Nightbot is running. Yeah, Nightbot's always running because it's on too lazy to turn it off. Because it, it's literally like a five minute process to turn it off and turn it back on. So I just like leave it on. We don't, again, we don't normally do these streams. It's really just the question like it's you guys gotta admit it's a pretty weird ass stream that we do every week just sit there for f three to four hours and answer questions is a little weird no it needs to be done i listen to it all the time mate when i'm on the way to work it's um, it's awesome that's what we're here um it's kind of when we put it on to like 2 p.m new york time to 5 p.m so just you know nice. knock knock off their friday 360. Yeah. i'm thankful of the uh the Eastern States Daylight Savings ending now. I'll always be able to catch the tail end of it again. Well, we'll, um, what is it? April 11th, we have Daylight Savings here, so... Next week's we'll be able to start it at 6am, our grid. No more 5am starts. Woohoo! Yeah, that would be nice. Yeah. How are we going, Red? Uh, low on shields. Trying to recharge. Yeah, I had to oh. run away because they were all coming after me because I'd love a hammerhead. Should we go and assist Algrid? Sorry? Red? Do you need yep. assistance, Algrid? We no, can go and uh, help you. You're right. only like 30 k's away from us, so... We've got a target. No, we've got a target yeah, behind us. That's a hammerhead in front of us. Away to There's not... a target behind us as well, though, which is a hammerhead as well. Yep. On G's. 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 Uh, yep. We'll go help Jezza. He's on his own. We'll own. get the support craft around at first. Yep. You Redeemer, stand by. Just, mark, just make marks and I'll shoot what you tell me to shoot. We I've do have a, some I friendlies a, who are red. I've got a Gladius, Renard. Ooh. Yep. Yep, he's in target. Yeah, I had him and I lost him again. Dead right. front, dead front, yep, dead got front. Him, got him. Got a chance sensitivity, I didn't turn it up. And I've turned off gyro or something. No, I do have gyro. Putting you back in right. Wrong way. It's all right. No, sorry, I'm oh, just yeah. I didn't set something up. Something's going on. I think I've got the... Done. No, not that one. Cutlass Black, 2K's dead front. It's only a wreckage, but we'll clean it. Far away. Missile launch. Killing a hammerhead. Okay, we've got the hammerhead heading to that. Yep, that's working now. Nice work. Nice flying red. I'm still showing Thanks. G's. Nope. Better you than me, mate. <laughs> very laggy um, missile launch. Yeah, there's definitely some desync. I'm picking up on it because. Noticing it a lot more in the turret than I was when I was flying. Uh, listen here, execute. No excuse for desync, mate. You know. Executes excuses. That's a that's a new <laughs> segment coming soon. It's all the way. Touch that. Oh, I played desync for everything, really. I need to worry. No, it's it, it's but... really obvious because um he's like call, making little calls and stuff, and seeing I'm seeing like half a second after he is. I've also got a little bit of lag because I'm streaming as well. Um. But I'm hoping the optimizations with the game that coming in the next patch will give us a little bit extra FPS. For those which are missing, not the only one. Has it finished or are there any more targets? I believe is no more targets. All right. Is that three of three, Algrid and Mal? It's three of five. Oh, three of five. Oh, God. Yes. Oh, it is five. Yes, it is five. It is five. Yeah. Right. Because the, the other thing is the comms ones are. That come after that like this week's was the worst i've ever seen there's only three of those though oh look yep. it's a bad guy over there eight k's away called agrid let's go kill him 
want to kill him. No, I'm gonna I got, refuel. I got no control. Uh, Sam Grip is just taking me wherever he wants me to go. I've been abducted. Been kratenapped. Oh. I need to oh, put out a call is. out to the Agvacy. Come save me. Is Agvacy's tally? Because they're busy at the moment. They're doing escort duties. Yeah. Yeah, that's it. Ag gets the preferential treatment. I don't. Yeah. You guys excited yeah. for the rework for the tally? Yeah, we're talking about it just before. Yeah, and I'm really nervous because we've seen nothing about it. So it's either going to be really good and glorious, or or really absolutely bad. Mm. Yes, it could be. There, there've mm. been designer threads, like some really talented people have put up alternate interiors for years for the Retaliator. Yeah, well, There's some really elegant designs. Won't the biggest thing be it will be showing us the current design la language for Aegis? Well, they kind of worked on it for... for... No, because Retaliator is one of the uh, yeah. oldest Aegis ships. So, uh, it, so it's not going to be it's, a design kind of, then. It's be kind of like old... exterior should be pretty hang, much the same. Hang on, let me speak. So it's, it's, it, it's kind of like this for Anvil, because this is one of the oldest ships for Anvil, and the F8 Lightning is one of their newest ones. So it's going to be a similar thing, where bigger manufacturers... Um, have a very have different eras. Appetoir. Yeah. Our, well, repertoire, not appetoir. But um yeah, and over time too. Like and I think Anvil six hundred years, RSI is nine Agra, how long is um Aegis, do you know? I've been around. I can't tell you Aegis. Uh Case Aerospace was a lot a lot older. Yeah, well that's why Anvil's six hundred years, because it's Chase um, Aerospace and Anvil. Uh Aegis is a relative newcomer. Even though they were building ships for the Mesas, they don't get the nasty tarring that uh, Aegis get. Execute, can you try and jiggle your repair and refuel? Just to uh, see if that gets it to work. Roger, two secs. Yep, it's working for me now. Thank you. Yep, cool. Done. Uh, well, it's just, um, uh, good job, everyone. Everyone's doing a really good job. Fight back at Crusader. So it was, it was founded in 2532 and we're at 2952 or something like that, aren't we? So that's like about the same age as Anvil almost. So they're a little yo little younger than Anvil, probably a 100 to 50 years younger than Anvil. So yeah, about 550 yeah. years. Somewhere in that, wait, I can do the math. Wait, let me, let me get a Execute, can you actually I just want to say refuel? Hang it on. hasn't worked for me. All right, just get out of the ship. Oh, just get out of the ship. I'll, tell you, I'll show you how to do it. Get out of the ship. Yeah. Right now, you get back in on your own once you're out, and it should work. Um, so what is it? Twenty nine fifty two minus. What did I say? We're going to Hurston, by the way. Twenty five. Um, Magda. Roger twenty five. All right. If you want to form up on the uh, carrot guys, we'll try a group jump. How about it? Yeah. Uh, four hundred and twenty years. Be... Did it work? No, it didn't. Okay, get out. Let me try. If I knew how to do a group jump, I would. A group jump, I would. So just all you have to do is uh, get uh, get close to the carrick, so get close to my ship, and uh, my now. ship should do the rest. To have our quantum drive on, you got you got to be spooled up. Yeah. Spooled up. Once you once you get close, keep your quantum drives off. Once you get close to me, I'll say, spool up quantum drives. And then um, you'll all spool up. You should just see the one uh, location that I'm looking at. Nice, it's work. Yep, yeah, I did it all. So good. All right, thank you. Oh shit, that wind knocked me back. I'm just cruising at a nice slow fifty. The sun. Apologies for that. Execute. What for? Passing wind, mate. Oh, that's fine. Don't worry about it. Didn't even hear it. Yeah, but he did. Oh, that's fine. It's just being polite. All right, just let me know when you're all formed up. We're not with you guys. We'll just do it on our own because we're coming from the ground. Copy. I'm still 3k away. Where the hell are Copy they? That. I didn't see them. Oh, dear. We must. Well, there's Mal above us. He's 31, 31 million away. We're a little bit far away, but we're getting there. Mr. Red, good on, on you, mate. Magda, yeah. 
Okay, maybe. Yeah, it's where we are. Yeah, I know. I can't see them though. I just don't know where everyone is. I thought they'd be right here. Other side of the side of the sun. Uh... I'm on the top turret, Red. All right. How are you doing on ammo? Mate, we're doing yeah. really well. 100%. Oh, okay. Six o'clock. Yeah, the sun makes it very hard to... Uh... All right, pull up a little closer, Argrid, if you can. <clears throat> All right. Now, what do I do? Spool up. Everybody, everybody, hit their B button, and you should see a single destination in front of us. Roger that. Let's make sure your route is clear. Route is clear. Oh, I'm falling down to Crusader. Yeah, me too. What happened? Right, Must be a again. bug. Roger. And Turn my screen is flat. Just nope, make sorry. sure on your maps, your route is clear. So you've got nothing set on your map. I should be the only one with something set on my map. I've got this weird bug, guys, where um, if you hover over Crusader. Up again. Okay, everybody hit the B button so you're not spooled up and map is clear. Okay, let me clear my map. Let me know when you're done. My map's clear. <laughs> Right. That's okay, Red. I'm going to spool up. You should then up. Um, be able to hit the B button now. And once everyone is spooled up, I will uh, engage the quantum drive. Spooled up. Stop moving, Sangrippa. All right, almost. Welcome. There. I'm almost going there. back to the menu. Looks like everyone is spooled up and ready. All right, Sorry. let's see if uh, this works. Go into quantum. Yeah. I see could ya. just edit that out, Rick. <laughs> <laughs> she just left and everyone's just sitting on. Yeah, uh, it didn't work. So, Sorry, Malcolm, what did you nobody, say? Nobody came with? Oh, the carrot went. We all watched it leave. It was great. Yeah. <laughs> uh, sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. Yeah, sadly. It does. it's a bit didn't the work. Yeah. Okay. Is that so, where the we, mission is? is? And... Oh, the whole, uh, the whole uh, wing, we're just sitting there waiting. Uh, yeah. Looks like my game crashed. Is, isn't the yeah, mission yeah. around Magda? Mission is around Magda. When it does work, it is quite amazing to see everybody next to you in the, quantum the, travel. The, the thing is, we're at Magda. Why are you warping away from Magda? Because it would look um, good. Execute. It would look good. I was told Crusader was the uh, next uh, location. No, I, I said Magda. Sorry. I, I misheard. Yeah, it's because we've got two groups. Turning right around. The moment. Just head where you need to head, Agrid. And we'll go to you. Hey guys, just give you an update. We've had to exit to menu because our game crashed. Yeah, well, we had a glitch, right. but you know. No one's at the mission site yet. Red, you happy to continue, mate, or do you want to hop back into our Discord? What do you want to do? Um, yeah, I'm happy to continue. Discuss, How about you? You shouldn't yeah. discuss abandoning people in front of the people you're going to abandon. <laughs> Oh, I wouldn't say abandon. <laughs> More like a holiday. <laughs> no, mate, it's all good. Reallocating to a secondary priority task. We just don't want to hold anyone up, that's all. Yeah, I get it. Because it, 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 it takes a while. To yeah, get back. it's fine. Like, well, what we'll do is we'll keep going. If you guys want to drop out, then we'll just keep going with this and when we finish this one because the next one's shareable but this one's not so it might be just easier for comms if you guys are on your discord but i'll reach out i'll send a message to just pm me mail and i'll uh I'll send you a message back when we're done no oh, good mate i just don't want to hold you guys up that's all yeah i get it and, and the comms is a bit confusing for everyone because i think that's why um expat tried to head to crusader because you heard that you guys are going to crusader 
See, that, that's right. where we dropped out because we were um, mm. traveling through one of the OM points in Crusader. And because we were traveling at some sort of altitude, it, it just despawned our ship and we were free falling towards the. Yeah, the we planet. heard all that. Oh, it was just so crazy. All right. My link still sends me to Crusader. That's part of the link, so which one do want me to go to? Checking the map again. So it's sending you into Crusader, is it? Or? Look at the map. Uh, Crusader, oh, it's going to Yella. What did I say? Magda, didn't I? Yeah, you did. You did say Magda. All right. Yes, it's Yella. Yes, we're up to Yella. Yella, I can. I'll be right back. Apologies. The commander did have some extra whiskey with his dinner tonight, guys. So just. Oh, he did. He had a couple of glasses of 389. A very, very nice Australian wine. <laughs> uh, 20 year old Australian wine. Let's uh, mm. say. Uh, 900 and. Uh, oh, almost a thousand years old, that wine. Very nice. My goodness. Of course, that be, aware of that, that be fun? You know, I'll tell you what, and... that would be a lovely and fun collectible in Star Citizen if you could actually find rare bottles of things, you know? I would actually, yeah. I would actually love a mission or even just, you know, down the line, if they eventually make it so we could find like old... You know, old CD players, old <laughs> yeah. records, old, you know. Like it, like playing um, a jukebox ancient... or something. Yeah. Exactly. So, you, you know, ancient earth trinket, <clears throat> you know. Yeah. That'd be cool. Would it be functional? Or well, like a, an 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 drive. Like an antique store yeah. or something like that, you know. <laughs> but, you know, old earth collectibles. Or whatever. Yeah, for hangar decoration, hangar yeah. swag and stuff. Yeah. Maybe that's yeah, a job on. Going into a store. A job on Earth where you actually go in and try and find rare trinkets to sell. Like you go into a danger zone or something. Yeah, that'd be so fun. Yeah. Well, I would imagine the Ark has some of that stuff as well. True. My ambition... Was that Algrid? The, the Ark? The Ark. Mm. Oh, the Ark oh, Museum. The Ark. Yeah. Oh! Ah. Where is, where is that? Ooh. Um... One of those like, system, I think. It's in one of the systems that doesn't have a lot of life in it. I remember that much. The Ark three, oh, I cool. think. The Ark, the Ark is the museum that actually creates the star map and the Galactopedia. Okay. Created after we butchered a planet. Interesting. Tack, the Tayak system is where it is. The Ark oh, that the, would be great to visit. The Ark is a vast library and archive station located in the Empire of Earth of UEE government TAYAC system, the largest library and archive in the UEE. It's a TAYAC. The Ark houses records, curated information, and artifacts pertaining to inclusive knowledge of all known space-faring sparing, space -faring civilizations. See, I would imagine that that would be a very high-priority target for... Uh, probably not only pirates, but for anybody who wanted to wipe humanity out of the universe, you know, like kill the history. Yeah. It, it's it's not necessarily the only library. It is it's one that's open to everyone. So they actually gather it for everything, mm. and they it's an it's a post mither uh, library that was created because we want to say how nice we are. Okay. So, no, a, good, I, a good lump of propaganda in there as well. Perfect. <laughs> it's, you know, I, I'm sure that the family uh, contributed. Oh, I'm sure. I'm sure Hurston have a wing. Oh, you know, we, we, we did um we did give uh, Esperia their leg up. Ah, okay. Their, their creation, their, their first, um, the vessel that, brought them to the attention of the UEE was um, a glaive commissioned by a Hurston. Hirst well, I can, I can imagine that that would be something that... I um, can't remember the uncle's name. But, very you know, highly sought after. Uh, one, of the, one of the uncles had, a, uh, had managed to acquire a glaive 
with both of them uh, functioning. And uh, the Asteria boys alien. were commissioned to make it flyable. Nice. Is that the one with the kind of like you going forward? I think it's. The, I think that's the one where you lay down inside. Yeah, it is. Uh, yeah. But it's the one with the two two blades on either side, not just the. Just the one. Oh yes. Yeah. I bet that made quite a stir at parties. Yes, well, it was it was really, it was revealed at um, an IAE, and uh, the Hurston got in it and flew it away. <laughs> nice. And that was that was what put the the Asperia boys on the map. The Navy went and said, "Hey guys, we want you to uh, build a lot more of those for us." Or what's the Navy? The Navy all of our ones that broke. Commissioned Asperia uh, ships at one point. Sorry? They, do, they still do, don't they, with prowlers and stuff like that as well? They build all of it. They, they collect, they actually build or collect all the uh, blueprints of ships and then rebuild them because that's what they do. See, I can't imagine, I can't imagine the UEE Navy having an easy time integrating that kind of ship into their. Um, into their fleet, you know, with the names. they're usually used for practice rather than actually fleet fights. Yeah, it's yeah. Right. You don't you don't actually integrate them. You have an aggressor squadron, and they I think fly only those ships. I think the other part is separate. the other part is like things like the glaive and the siphon that they're actually human reproductions that Asperia makes, so they're more tailored to a human because vandals are also like eight and a half feet tall, so they're actually modified. Um, so, yeah. they, they build them just back, but they keep the interiors the same. Same as the, uh, yeah. the, the sites that we've got. They've been modified, yeah. even though they're proper sites, they've been modified yep. uh, to to be usable by humans. Mm. Which uh, means they're slightly slower because we are squishy and malle malleable. Yeah, um, and, um, and even the reproductions are made from parts and reproduced parts. Sam Grover, can you hand out, head down to Orison, man? I'm going to upgrade this. Sure. That's actually quite fun because um, if you if you if you imagine uh, like an encounter with a vandal, you know, how mm. did you how did you get away? How did you defeat them? Well, yeah. my ship has a pretty small door. <laughs> <You know? laughs> yeah. The damn thing couldn't get in. Yeah, they tried to. Hey guys, got that weird. Uh, you, you know, when they're like the big monsters trying to put the claw in through the little hole. I've got that. Yeah, exactly. But it's like a vandal trying to grab the human. It's like, can't get me. Wall, just want to let done. you guys know, myself and Red will be just sort of ducking up. But just wanted to say it's been an absolute privilege to hang around with you guys. So, you know, Rose, you guys, you guys are awesome. You know, and um, love you guys. Oh, you're awesome. All right. Yeah. yeah. You're you're great. Great. Thank you guys. <laughs> yeah. yeah. No, man. All right. Have a good one, Nate. Look after yourselves. See you, boys. Have a good one. Bye. No worries. Hello. The toughest. Um, so we actually had someone typing questions, even though we're not taking questions, but I'll do this one. So Gastop uh, says, which overdrive phase do you reckon has been the toughest and the most fun to run through? For I hated the comm one. Uh, it was just bugging out for me. So this week's um, overdrive four was a pain in the butt. Um, and the easiest was probably the career one, which is the last stage of that. Um, but yeah, just that comms I one was say, really buggy. I would say the easiest one was the one where you had to get the little chip out of the out that's, of the ship and deliver it. The lieutenant. Oh, there's that's essentially two. one. Oh, yeah, that's two ships. That was fairly lengthy, but but easy. I'll give you that one. But the the career one, I just walked in, hit the console, and I was done. Oh, it was just like it literally took like thirty seconds, and then I was done. Um, but again, I I'm just probably more more of a natural fps player so you got lucky on that one then the most yeah challenging slash engaging one was probably the bunker one but it was mm. slightly repetitive i think it would all... be nice to have mixed up the bunker with this one that we're doing now. yeah you know so one well, that's what it'll be eventually the bunker the next mission is the yeah um fleet fleet battle then the next mission is bunker just to get you kind of 
Well, that is the plan. I don't know if, if you, I don't know how much you've looked into the actual mission system, but that is the plan. So the mission will always have varying forks and different outcomes, and you can repetitively do it. And yeah, nice. Yeah, so it's all gonna. You, you never essentially are gonna do the same mission twice. Um, so. How did I get to Yella so fast, guys? Are uh, you in a car? Probably upgraded. You left five minutes before everyone. Oh, else. you left us all in the dust. That's right. I remember now. Oh, that's right. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> ah, Lady Grace. Hello. Hello. Uh, a very fine looking ship you have there. If not very scary. Dave Lobe says, hey guys, any news on modularity and or Caterpillar rework? By the way, I love your work and thanks for your awesome content. Um, other, we did talk about the Retaliator earlier. We're just kind of really we waiting did. to see what it's going to turn into. And the Caterpillar, I think that is, like the more we look at that, the more further away it looks because I think it's going to need a bit of a rework to at least bring it on par with the Galaxy. Um, if you think about how you got those small rooms, there's a couple of different ways they can do it. They can leave it as the small rooms, but it's a lot of work. Or you could essentially replace the whole front end. Um, but it's just like, it's one of those holdover ships from Kickstarter that just didn't age well. Um, so it is what it is. It's an easy design for them to play with though. Yeah, but like you, you know as well as I do, Sangre, but like it's got the elevator doors, it's got the actual doors itself, it's like five little modules and a nose, and it's got a command module that drops off the sides. Like that ship's got a lot going on in a small space. It does. Yeah. Well, I, I tend to think that they'll leave it to one of the last ships, mainly because I, I, mm. I always, I've always referred to it as a, as a cheap man's um, endeavor. Endeavor. I know it's weird and it's not really a cheap man's endeavor, but that's that's how it comes across. Yeah. Well, it's not so cheap anymore because now it's only twenty bucks cheaper. But um... yeah. But when you when you look at what the ship is going to be in game and and um... well, it kind of shows how much the endeavor's gone up in price, doesn't it, Algar? In here, that, no, no. Oh, yeah. How much the endeavor's going up in on, price? Are you on site? Are you on location? I am in location. I'm just looking for the uh, the site location, the... guys. All right, we're stored. It's been sitting at OEM one waiting. Oh, there's a nice little bug. It did remove my hair. Can you see my hair come through my pony to open my helmet? Um, uh, yes, it is. Oh, a nice little bug there. And my backpack's not on. Yet. Oh, wait a minute. I've got, some, I've got some components here from when I upgraded the Redeemer. That'd be a different size engine, though. Yeah, I, know, I just checked. I was just double checking in case I'm saving myself the run. Our site location got changed. Say again? The incursion site got changed. Where is it now? We are. Someone must have finished it while you were, we were all getting there. Yep. And we're back at Hurston. What I would do, what I would say <laughs> is maybe uh, just sure. time to get refueled and uh, all that kind of stuff and just chill here. Somebody else is doing the mission. It'll cycle back here. Otherwise, you're just playing ping pong. Oh, no, I threw it away. What a shame. Well, that depends whether someone's going to do the mission. Yeah. This elevator is not going anywhere. Can you press a button, Sankar, because it's not working for me. Agrid just needs to go there Weird. and just kill one ship and stay there. Magic fingers. Yeah, I don't know what it was. I tried heaps. Just... There we go. Yeah, Providence. Yeah. The next shuttle is approaching the station. Back home. All right, back home. Do you know what? Yeah. I, I always wondered why they didn't do this as a step. 
and have like an upper level and then like an elevator down to the lower level so they didn't have to have these shuttles jump up over each other. I just found that really I weird. Think, I think they're trying to minimize elevators for anti NPC movement. Oh, again, it could have been stairs, didn't need escalators. But you get my point, right? Like if they'd had that flat and then about halfway along here, that went down at an angle and then you had another flat one, the ships wouldn't have to do this slow down, up and around, down roller coaster thing that they're trying to do. Maybe they're just trying to see if they could actually do that with the ships. It's crystal. Well, when you get over here, they've actually done it because that's how I know it's all possible. Because over here, they are on different levels and they do have a stairs. You'll see what I mean when we get over here. It's all ships, hold jump, hold jump. They rebuilt naval dockyards and tried to make them fancy and nice. I just heard hold jump, hold jump. Al Grant, when you say Crusader, did you mean your missions there, Crusader? Sorry? No, he, no, he did not mean that. His missions are Hurston. Okay. I, I'm bagging out Crusader because I'm Hurston. Well, I'll just bag out all these little companies that have got these rats and mice problems we have to come and sort out. Yeah, see? So, like, look, low one, upper one. Yep. For passengers. The shuttle is preparing to deploy. Have you got a rat and mice problem on your station? Don't forget to get a Raptor today. <laughs> I genuinely wanted one of those. The cleaner with claws. Right, I'm going to get I'm going to get a, a couple of those little dogs. I think. Yeah. What chihuahuas? I vote those, um, those critters. I'm going to get a couple of them. Put mm. them in my ship. Mm. Every time someone tries to board, yeah. they just get <laughs> abused yeah, by the dogs. That's right. Yeah. How much fun is it going to be trapping those dogs, releasing them to elevators, and releasing them on stations? That's what everyone's <laughs> going to be trying to do. So, or, you like that? Yeah, yeah, release it in the elevator and they just run out and then it stays there for the next person to come along. That's yeah. kind of funny. Yeah, I like that. You open the elevator and run away and it comes into the actual living area. Yes. <laughs> yes. I mean, you'd actually Sorry. be able to drop them off at the resident at the business district in Hurston. Or is it Hurston? Lawville. Mm. You do that, we will shoot them. Oh, I guarantee you. There will be quite a few <laughs> screenshots with the, um, mm. the quote, uh, walking my dog. And um, they'll be in all kinds of places. I mean, well, I, I suppose if I, I think if I landed on top of one with a Pisces, it would just go in the Pisces, you know, like the NPCs. Mm hmm. So you, you might want to grab a drink while you're here and execute. Measure. Yeah, I've already got drinks on I guess the real question is what's the minimum or maximum safe distance you can drop one? Yeah, and I wonder if they survive in zero G. Zero G doggos. Are you going to leave them on some of the uh, station, not stations, but the outposts and the, um, oh, oh, the com comorais? I'm going to take one to um, Benny Hatch. Oh, comorais will die. And and no. park it next to the uh, the guy who's dead under the uh, <laughs> under the thing and take a picture. Sick and twisted individual. Fill up the back of a prowler with lots of them, fly low over someone, and then from the pilot desk go open all doors. Go on, doggies. And I just jump through the ashes. So you can get them into a bunker. Oh, no, I was thinking of filling up Hurston with them. It'll be absolute chaos. And, um, yeah, wouldn't it be fun if you had, like, a bird flying around your ship? That's no way to talk about the Trevaran. No, no, no. our colleagues and equals there. I don't have feathers. Look, old man Hurston likes Trevaran. Yeah, that, that, I wonder, um, has there been, so I've got a question, I've got a question, I'm, I'm, I'm jumping the queue, um, has there been any, uh, discussion in the past as to whether we will ultimately be able to play as a, an alien species? Yes. Or will... Yes. There has been talk about it. Yeah. 
So it's planned, but it's it depends how big the game gets, essentially. Yeah. Oh, so, you know, so, so, so you know how there's aliens behind the aliens? Right, so, yeah. so, so for example, the Kathak is behind the, the, the Zion, right? It's clearly intended yeah, so that... Yeah, you mean the Kalrathi, right? No, it's, well, it's called the Kathak. But um, long story short, if you think about it, Squadron 42 is essentially... The first episode is really us fighting ourselves, then us fighting the Vandal, then us working with the Vandal to take out the enemy behind them, right? And then, and that's the three episodes. And then, then if you did an Zion expansion, there's not, we don't have a lot of Zion ships. So that would build out their home world, their galaxy. Um, there'd be a, an expansion, let's say it's three episodes as well. It'd be one with them, one with them and us, and then one with them and the aliens behind them. So eventually, if you went around all the aliens and you discovered the aliens behind the aliens, you then got room to do their expansion packs as well. So it's just essentially growing out the universe as you go around. It really depends how popular it gets at the end of the day. Can I... Right. Hagrid, have you got hostiles in your sights? Uh, I did have a, a site, but then they all disappeared. Um, yeah. I've got a hostile there's... in sight. What is he? Either. Did that answer your question, expert? Or yeah, I mean, uh, I, I'm just, uh, I was just curious if they, uh, if they ever said that might be something they wanted to do. Maybe it was even in a Kickstarter. I don't know. We not even, well, into... not Kickstarter. Well, we even, is... we even have theories about some of them. So the Kathak, right? One of the things they talk about in the law, and like I brought this up and pitched it to Algrid and Paul, and they've thought about it a lot because now Paul talks about it as well. But basically, I think because they called it the Spirit Wars. And I said to him, I think the Kathaka robots because they don't have souls. And that's why it's called the Spirit Wars. Um, ah. and, and then, like, over time, the more you think about it, the more... And there's no more robot... Their, um, there's no like, robots... Like, psychopathic. Or something like that. But there's no, just psychopathic but there's no, got no... But there's no robots in the game at all. Right? Because of the law of humans, they, they all, every time they build AI, it goes to shit. Right? So if you were going to bring in AI robots in, you could do it as a whole new race after the fact. So... Oh, right. right it's just an so idea I would, imagine, I, I've got... I would imagine that a quest line could also be um about fighting people trying to rebuild an ai yes that's that would... already been Definitely. part of the story with the different imperator candidates but i think what she means is as, as another quest line like a breakout scientist going yeah but i've done what you guys have not done or whatever something like that. the way yeah. the way they've set up the world they've got different ways they can go mm. and if they want to they could clearly put in a revenant storyline yeah so very much blade runner like the the, ah. the world is set where that would fit perfectly and they have for example the lost world the oritani system um so there are human worlds that are no longer in contact one one system oh, Hagrid, if you head towards me there's a uh, hammerhead in this direction <laughs> one targeted just pop it away again joe I don't know what is um, going on here, but it wouldn't. It's allowed me to buy every other component, but it would not allow me to buy a power plant. And every time I go to a we shouldn't need the power plant. I got everything else though. Why can't Why can't I put a power plant on? Ah, finally, even says I've got two of them. That's how buggy it is. <laughs> anyway, we're done. Uh, we're well, gonna it's done. Awesome, yeah, yeah. That's all it is. Well, look at all the components I brought that I didn't need to buy. Yeah. In terms of alien races, I don't expect that to be anytime soon, like at least five years before Trevaran are playable. Of course, yeah. And, and part of that is that I'll be the first. story wise, they've really set up for a Rome storyline. Well, Tavaran, Tavaran are, hang on, hang on. Tavaran are actually in Squadron 42, as is the Zion. So they will both be in, not playable, but we'll both see them in Squadron 42. Yeah, well, I mean, we can buy Trevaran ships right now. And the UAE Navy has Trevaran in it. So yes. That's, that, that, that very much meets the Star Wars thing of making it more alien. That would be a great yeah. thing to unveil at uh, an Invictus, for example, um, having some Tavarin, um recruits. You need to link just that. Just mulling around. Uh, oh, hang on, yeah. I'll, I'll link it. The thing that you sent me today, Agra, because I think that'll change expat's thought process very quickly. Um, hey, Hollington, can you get this thing off me? I've got something after me. Hang on. Open that. 
So I'm, this is two. Actually, I'll see if I can do it. Uh, I'm going to send these both to you. These are two images that have been sent to me today, expert. Um, and they've just done the Q and A huh. bits on about yeah um, the event. But you read those, and especially the one where it talks about special gets reveals and shuttle tools. I was like, what? So you want to try and see him get your ticket for that yourself? Self ticket for that. Post convention event, variety of newly introduced perks shared soon. It's much more expansive, God, and expensive. I'm, I'm sure. Oh, it's a hundred bucks more uh, than a standard ticket. So what trumps? We don't know prices yet. Not the studio. Well, last year's was, <laughs> last yeah, year's was a uh, hundred bucks more, so I'm assuming roughly the same. The the gala event is not. A ticket to uh, I see, on, but they totally will include event. shuttle tours to the Manchester studio. Interesting. Mm -hmm. Okay. And they'll probably have batches of uh escorts. Mm. Probably probably yep. set themselves. But they said this cam company. they said this camera's available to be used in there and encouraged. Well, they said they encouraging people to have their cameras, but with yep. certain areas you can't use it. Yeah. No, well, they'll have they'll have the they'll have the Real meat and potatoes hidden behind. Mm. And I've got them with going put that to all in the back room. Sorry, I cross talked over you, Algrid. Hmm? I cross talked over you there, so so they didn't get the information that you were delivering. So I'm going to rearm. I've got to go to the space station and rearm, and then I'll. Is this mission complete? Yes. Mission complete. Oh. Is that no? That's four or five now, isn't it? It's four or five. Okay, we're, we're, we're ticking him over. Didn't they get me? Yeah, they. Um, there's a very strong storyline possibility of a civil war for the UEE mm. between Sol and Terra. Well, I think um, they're building up the, the storyline for the Tavaran already. We've got, mm -hmm. I think there's a Tavaran civil war coming. Yeah. Oh, the third Tavaran war. That, that's absolutely in there. Yeah, but I think I think it's a civil war. And I think you see that in the stories they've put out already. And I think that's also the groundwork for for us. I think we'll play as, well, I would say, most likely, if we're doing Tavaran, Tavaran in the UEE. And that, what because was the it, other one we talked about? Like a prequel as well could be a potential a possibility as well. Oh, they could always do the, yeah. the actual Tavaran War itself. Well, maybe it's both. That'd yeah. be kind of cool. Like, it goes, well, it all started back here. And you actually play through all three Tavaran Wars. So it's like the past and then the future, present future type. Well, some cutscenes at least. Yeah. And well, no, no, no. If you remember, with... to explore the, uh, Sorry. what it feels like to be a Tavaran inside the UEE. And especially, yeah, I, think, yeah. War, I think that's why we'll do is that. There, is there a discrimination that develops between you and the fellow crewmates? Well, I think it'll allow you to see all sides if they do the past you know the and the present and the future you get you get to see all sides of it so like is there a kind of like a reconciliation and then they get accepted into the ue at the end or or is it always they're shunned or or what was it like when they first got there as well and i i think there's a really cool story there it almost reflects um and i'm thinking american wise here like the american indians is is what they remind well, me no, of I was especially gonna, I was with the gonna say the uh, with the feathers japanese um during oh. world war ii I'm just thinking the Japanese the, Americans. I'm just thinking about the feathers, though. You know how they've got the feathers, the Indian headdress, but I'm, I'm probably oh, yeah, okay. like probably seeing stuff that yeah, yeah, probably not. I'm probably saying stuff that's not there, but yeah. But you're right. It could be a mi uh, a mix of cultures as well. Uh, the Japanese Americans, even uh, German Americans, like a good sort of all back to World War Two. Um, but we do know it's Roman based as well. But why can't they um, draw on other time periods and histories? Oh, they they absolutely have, but a, a lot of it is much more um, established. So sort of four or five hundred years back and further. Um, so they are drawing from lots of different inspirations. You can see it in the depth of their writing. Uh, I can't move. I freed up in a moment once. Yeah, oh, don't tell me that's. So I, I, I tend to think they'll do the Tavaran will be, the Tavaran story will go the Civil War route. And I think we'll end up playing as Tavaran 
or we'll have a UAE to the own. And the idea is we'll be trying to learn our history. So we'll have all the UAE history already known because we're UAE. But trying to find the Tavaran history will be the will be the challenge. Uh, because a lot of the Tavaran in the purge they actually hang on, wiped hang out. Hang on, Aaron. What are you what are you doing here, Fancy Pants? You don't even look like oh, it. You know, right. just, uh... You've got a different face on. You're not the real expert. She's got like that just uh... that side days cut bald thing and she makes faces like she's having an orgasm when she talks. Oh, that looks more like you. There we That's go. a bit personal. The real expat. You've never seen, like me and expat when we've been off stream, she really, like, she goes to talk, she goes, oh, 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 just goes, it just goes so funky. Oh, my face, my face isn't working. Oh, yeah. no. What's that thing from Mass Effect? My face is tired. You know, um, try connecting. Are you connected to the in-game comms? Because I think it's linked. Welcome to the ASOC. Uh, I can try Hello. Wait, I'll try it. Okay. Right. Hello? Camera. Hello? Can you all see my face moving? But I don't have my camera on for it, so it wouldn't be working for me. And I got a beard. The beard always. Can you see my face? Yeah, the yeah yours is moving. Oh, oh, wow. That looks that looks hideous. A very broad oh. smile. Oh. <laughs> a, she laughs like she's a dentist. You know what I mean? <laughs> Or you're walking on hot, or you're walking on hot coals or something. <laughs> oh dear. Um, do you know they added a really in Hell Divers? They added this little weird thing. You know the little thing that you do to pull, call in your stratagems. They now make it if you type in game, your character does this. It types on the on the little thing just in the last patch. It looks really fun. <laughs> nice. It looks really cool because like you can go, oh, they're typing. Um, yeah. All right, Hangar 6. Wait, what are you doing, Expert? You coming with us or are you going elsewhere? Uh, no, I'm headed to, uh, I'm headed to the clothes store. Ah, I've got some uh, experimentation Ooh. to do. Well, that's, th that's the thing that a lot of people don't see behind the scenes with you, isn't it? Because they're all, you're always having to go buy all your gear. Something. Yeah, exactly. There's a lot of, there's a lot of preparation to, yeah. to everything. And the super secret new, uh, new skill set you learnt last night. Mm. I know. Someone's hot marking. Um, I don't know. Who was, what was the name? What was the name of the uh, uh, the, the the chap that uh, showed us that? Was it Hawks? Hawks. Yeah, that's it. Hawks. My goodness, it it just blew my mind. I, 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 he walked onto the Carrick. Yeah, but now you've shown everyone. The next patch, it'll be gone. And I'm like, oh my absolute goodness, God! Finally. But we, me and PC did a bunker yes, uh, yesterday, mm -hmm. wearing uh, civilian clothes and uh, armor and stuff. Yeah, I watched. And I it watching. was so much fun to do that. You looked like you, you were self-expression. You looked like you're out of Battlefield. You know those tactical operators in Battlefield. It looked yeah. a lot more modern. Uh, all of a sudden, it looked so much more modern of a game, and it mm. and it and it like it looked. You fly. Uh, you know, like special forces. You know, they could just wear whatever they want, really. Yeah. I just refueled it and opened the doors, obviously. Yep. But they really need to get that going because it, they've got so many like unique cosmetics in the in the in the store mm. and and t-shirts and oh, there's things that all the cassava outlets. There's some we need to be able to use it practically. Yeah, there's some flair they've sold like that you're meant to be able to put on your like your um like bobbleheads that you can put on your um cockpit and stuff, and they've never worked or anything like that. Yeah, so they do. Oh, they do now? Okay, cool. They, they do on uh, very, very few ships. Yeah. But there are a few ships you can actually put a bubble in. So, so again, they do work, but they don't work on everything. So they don't work, is my whole they're point. They're also really tiny, so they're hard to see. So but there's serious scaling issues in the interiors of um, Star Citizen ships. It's like, you look, you look from the outside and oh, yeah. see how big the pilot is. Yeah, hang on. Dante, what do you want, mate? Um, party invite, please, sir. Certainly. Dante, please tell me you fly an Inferno. So it's um, Dante's Inferno. Please. I do have an Inferno, yes, but my favorite happens to one. be the, um, what's there? Oh, how could you? Well, he goes to the ASOP terminal, and he presses the... Yeah. <laughs> 
I can only be so much on brand, expat, sorry. <laughs> well, maybe that's what you should call your Inferno um, expat, Dante. What's the um, what's the attraction with the uh, Corsair? I mean, so many people fly it and love it. The guns, the solo guns. It's the, D it's it's the DPS king. It has the most pilot-controlled DPS, I believe, of any ship in the game. Right now, yeah. It's still dry. Yeah. Do you want to know the other reason? The internal use of space in that model oh is superb. And you can contrast it with the cutlass, which they made bigger uh, when they redid the cutlass to improve the pathing for NPCs. And now they've gone back to a much more realistic metric. So clearly their NPC pathing on spaceships is significantly better than five years ago. Which is yeah. not unexpected, I but the interior that, is I gorgeous. I would you second that, and I would add to it the fact that it also has a midship boarding option in point of fact too, differentiating it above and beyond the MSR. Agreed. The, like the accessibility and pathing inside and the use of space, it's gorgeous. It's just you, I think I think you guys I think you guys also forget that every ship's got to go, go back and be brought up to a gold pass, right? So like MSR, the Connie, and all that, they're all going to go back and they're going to come up past the Connie, and the Connie's going to, oh, sorry, Cor Corsair's going to go up again as well. So it's it's just again you're looking at the ship in hindsight that it was further down the road than those as well, and I think a lot of people forget that they just go, oh, it's out, and that's all it's ever going to be, and no. They're all going to be gold pass, just like, and that's why it's the, the most exciting part about the Retaliator is not that it's getting a rework; it's that that rework you can see then see the leap, so you can see what's going to happen to every other ship, and that they're going to all leap forward like that. I I got to just say there, I genuinely don't expect a leap. I expect that they're going to move the landing collar. And leave the ship generally unchanged. Well, 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 well uh, that, that doesn't that doesn't take six months. That doesn't take eighteen months. It was originally on the roadmap for six, and they it's now blown out to over eighteen months. If it took it, it took them that long to do a door, I would be very surprised. No, that sounds, sounds to me like they just of uh, standardization. Yeah. I just hope that we know the 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 measurement metrics now, the size of things now the uh requirement for pathing now you know and i and i and actually actually that brings me to something that i'm very uh, uh one of the things that i'm probably most excited about the um the new mini map system is the mm. fact that the system is now able to path so i'm didn't you curious say that, didn't if you, that pathing can then be translated onto npcs yeah didn't, it's the same system didn't, didn't you see that back at citizen con the, the, the pathing thing they did that back then that the thing that i keep bringing up when we talk about the pathing is why isn't it doing it on the screen in front of me i have to keep constantly looking over the top left of my screen to see where this path is it's a hud thing on your visor why isn't it showing it on the floor so i can just follow the line on the floor I think with the I think with the crosshair technology, et cetera, they should be able to achieve that. But um I certainly wouldn't want it as something um that that was not, you know, able to be toggled off or on. Absolutely. You know? Absolutely. I and, think and, and I think yeah. as uh, they've talked about it before, different visors, so like a mining visor will be different to an explorer visor. Yeah. So 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 you can actually have like different styles and different strengths so maybe uh a mining one does not have pathing but an explorer one does i'm just trying to give a random example but yeah ups helmet yes, Pete. that one well he's actually playing we get to we get to see how terrible he is at the game no okay <laughs> wait is piss piss poor pete on let's have a look is he on let's, I'll, I'll, I'll turn on my telly and have a look. no he's, he's on your uh he's on your chat where Wait, wait. Oh, there he is! Hey, Pete, how you doing? Sorry, man, I'm not checking the chat. I'm. This is why I don't do gameplay. I, I, I've got too many heads. Oh, yep. Execute. Don't tell people you're not checking the chat. Just don't check the chat. Mm. But then, but then quietly, you know, every now and again, you know. Uh, no, this is this is this is recorded. This poor Pete, not live. Just recorded, man. Uh, no, no, not live. Mm. I never do live. I yeah, never do live. Uh, what was I going to do? Not that one. Okay, apparently there's somebody firing out here. It's going to be interesting in a second. It would be very interesting for them if you give us a location to jump to. 
Yep. Is there a mission share that they've missed? No, this mission can't no, no, be shared. No. Yeah. I'm about to take mission five of five for mission three. Understood. I'll do that once I leave the hangar, just in case I blow up. Because you never know. I'm almost about to regret our decision to jump out here, execute. Oh, yeah. You should try and do um, other things with him. He wants to walk everywhere, and I have to force him to run yeah. everywhere, and he gets mad at me. The cough is firing at you, Agrid? No, he's firing around just, you? Just, just scanning me. <laughs> I'm in the hangar, and they're scanning me. Bad. Kaif, I see here, above you. Well, I think somebody's going to have to talk to their manager. I know, I'm going to be talking to their manager. Especially at Hurston. It is over a station, so, you know, obviously they don't... What the... Yes, they are fine from inside the hangar. That's right. Agrid's taking red shirt applications for his javelin, mm -hmm. if anyone's interested. Right. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, I think uh, that ship blue. is outside the hangar. Yeah, after it scanned you, I think it just blew up on the side. Yeah, I got that impression. Yep. He said it was okay to leave, and then I just heard this big bang, and some debris flew past me. Oh no, that was that was him um, uh, committing um, seppuku or whatever yeah, it is. Seppuku. Well, <laughs> yes, seppuku. He realised that's right. Uh, he realised <laughs> that. Realized he realized that he bloody scanned um, Shit. <laughs> Um, it, that that's so that they don't kill his family as well. Yeah, that's right. That's so we don't kill his family. Mm. <laughs> I should put fair. I should put fair. That's all right. We've clearly identified that Hurston is the perfect recruiting ground for the Navy because everyone wants to get off. We're just refilling, um, I assume? Yeah. Well, you know, it, 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 they didn't read their contract. It, it's on them. I, I, you I, know. I'm sorry. I'm, Service to the Navy overrides all of these corporate contracts. Humanity's got a war, you know. People do yeah, Bishop. Contract, that, that's their problem. I'm sure that the Hurstons will gladly allow people to be free of their contract for a fee. I'll jump out of the seat and let you have a go I'll execute. The Navy pays. You'll be given appropriate compensation of five UEC per day. I'm kind of... Yeah, but at least the I'm, air's clean. I'm happy just uh, turret gunning, to be honest with you. Yeah, no, it's just a refuel and it's just yeah. being problematic tonight. Roger, Roger. Execute's going I, to I think the Hurston is going to be charging people. No, it's also getting late here as well. Like, I'm, I've been going to bed about 11 <laughs> p.m., so in about 30 minutes, I'd, be get, a lot of, I'd normally get into bed now and wind down with a, a show or whatever. Um, because uh, you got to remember, uh, me and Eric uh, get up at 5 a.m. to do stuff, so we try to keep that time pattern. Um, it's not the convenient, uh, uh, most convenient thing for, it's not the most convenient thing for parties and stuff like that, though. Um, it tends to uh, throw your old thing out. No, I can't. For three weeks, I've been going to bed. I'll have to exit the hangout because I flew us in. No, nah, that's fine. Just leave it where it is. It's fine. I know what it is. So I'm it's, just going to store and pull out again. Are you sure? I can take off. That's fine. Just store it and pull it out. It's fine. It's good to do it this way. Go ahead, Algrid. Sorry. Oh. Uh, I was just saying, uh, yeah, the last couple of weeks, I've been crashing at 8 o'clock. So, you know, and I think it's just recovering from... A trip to a hospital. Joyous that was. Once we go, uh, that elevator's not there. Nope. And we just got scanned as well. Yeah, we'll just... Unit commander wants to join us. Uh, wants wants to join your algorithm for the five out of five um, mission. Yeah. So he's the one in Sky. Mm -hmm. Do you um, jump in the ship, Albert. Um, execute, and I'll take us off. Yeah, you, know it's what, you know what I'll do? Next time I jump in with Piss for Pete, I'll probably just start streaming. That's what I should do. Fine with Piss for Pete. That's what I'll do. Honestly, I like to, when I play with other content creators, I like to just Chill. play. Yeah. It's nice to just... I, I do like, you know, all the camera stuff and everything, but sometimes it's nice just to... But we can't jump home with you. Just to help. You're... Just to just to assist. Just to we can be jump... there for someone. You know? We can jump on with Pissful Pete and play with Pissful Pete, but we, me and Pete can't jump on with you. Because you're always doing your story time. 
Yeah, my shenanigans. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, so, so maybe maybe you should just do a good gameplay one one time, and we'll come and join you. Algar, do you want to confirm where the next mission is? Uh, the next mission is an aerial. Okay. Uh, execute. We also have an invite for unit commander, please. Roger. They're on the server. Sometimes I do that, and I call them uh, I call them my science streams because usually when I'm doing science, it's um like a lot of concentration and a lot of uh, you know just trying to uh, get the game to do something. So it's not a lot of room for cinematics and uh, stuff like that. But uh, I I j but I mean honest honestly, I genuinely find it fun the way I play, like on stream. How do you spell this guy's Actually, name, sorry? Uh, unit Commander, they're on the oh, server. U-N-I-T-C-O-M-M-A-N-D-E-R. I am not... Oh, w okay, there he is. He wasn't there before. He's there now. All right, invite out. Hey, hey, Pete. Pete, just do what uh, just do what PC101 does. He very unsubtly in the chat just goes... And he actually apologized one day for it. Uh, mm. But I was like, no, no, it's cool, man. He just goes, hey... You need a, you need a, you need a wingman, or um, or I'll just be, I'll just be somewhere, and all of a yeah. sudden the ship will show up, and I'm like, wait a minute, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Pete, <laughs> Pete, get in here, come and jump on the Discord and and talk and and yep. jump in and help. We're just having to do overdrive if you want, and if you want to start up your stream, we'll raid out to you because we're gonna we're gonna wrap up here in probably the next half an hour. So if you, uh, probably, yeah, probably after this mission because I'm done. Yeah, yeah, because Agar's pretty cooked. He he said no, we won't do three hours, and we're literally five minutes off three hours. So, yep. um. He doesn't know Star Citizen. Right, I'm, I'm buggered. Yeah. So yeah, jump on Pete, and we'll um we'll raid out to you, man. And you can if you want to start up your stream, it's up to you though. Or expat if you want to do it instead. Whatever. Uh, no, no, I'm I, I I'm gonna have to eat lunch and do all that kind of stuff before I stream. Yeah. I like to eat before stream. I, I never eat on stream or any of that stuff. Yeah, yeah I don't well, like it. I, I don't like it either. Oh but, my goodness. But but I get a sweet tooth. I remember there was a couple of times early in the day when I was um, less practiced when mm. um, I would get so hungry on stream and it, it would just be the worst. Oh. Yep, I know that feeling. Yep. Try a three-hour stream in the morning. Uh, the one... Oh, God. When we run out of water, Agra, that's the one I can't stand. Oh, hell yeah. Yeah, and I'm like, oh, I just got to go. I got to go, got to go, got to go get a drink. And you also, like, because we're talking all the time, you tend to get a dry mouth as well. Um, yeah, and also... Oh, thank, just, you. thank you, Ziki. Also, just thinking about the questions and how to answer the questions does take does take it out of you. Yeah, it really does. Because you, you, there's a mental element to it, isn't it? You, you're constantly Yeah, you're mental. Thinking, yeah, yeah, yeah. Thanks. Thanks. Love you too. So, Agar, do you were planning to have some enemies in this mission somewhere? No, you can see the lights up here and there's random people on the server. Oh, there's one. Speak and he shall appear. Hello. Roll it, 180. There he is. What do we got? Uh, that is a Cutlass Black. Algar, can you see how many targets you've got left at this site? Uh, yeah, three of 24. Okay, you might want to make sure you get shots on something. Yep. I um, think I see I, something here. Everything's blue. That's the problem. Well, there's a red one where we're heading, if you can follow us. Over, can, I don't even see where I'm shooting, Algar, but over here. Yeah, I can't see where you are. The other, the other side of the large asteroid. I do that. Just hold off, Sam Gripper. We we'll get him yeah. in and get him, get him some hits on this one. Turn around, and see where he is. Do you want me to stop the random from get finishing the job? No, you're right. We've got time. Agrid's just behind us now, so you shouldn't be too far. Agrid, just get a top on it if you can. Still can't find him. He's over near us. Again, just head towards us, you'll see him. I'm shooting it uh, in, every in target, his direction. Every target is... Over here, Agar. Oh, got one, finally. Oh, he's just disappeared. There he is again. He's dead. 
Nah. Yeah, he's dead. I think they have to change your name, Agrid, from Old Man Hurston to Slow Man Hurston. Uh, no. <laughs> I'm flying through an asteroid field with millions of people. Everyone is blue, including the enemies. Really? Oh, uh, it's changed that if you want. Even, the, even the targets were showing blue, red. Oh, blue. That oh. was that one showed hmm. red just before he died. Everything else was showing blue. Is there still a target here, or is that one finished? That's done. You got credit for it? <laughs> yep. Yeah. All right, we're done. Well, we can head nice. back to Everest then. Five of five is done. Oh. Did you get off at the next mission? Uh, well, you guys can do the next mission. I'm going to bed. He's going to bed. We just want to catch oh, him no, up. No. We'll, we'll, we'll hop into the rest. Uh, we might even get on during the week, Algrid. I don't know what you're like. You're not usually free again until Tuesday, are you, Algrid? I'm not free again this week until... Um... Wednesday at the earliest. Do you want to do it Wednesday, Wednesday morning then? We'll do another one Wednesday morning. Yeah, we could probably do that. Yeah. All right. Oh, shush. I'm out of game. Yeah. Uh, let's find someone to raid to... then on the old Pichurini. Back to Hurston because that's home. Uh... And head back to Crusader. Uh, the Dark Law is streaming, if uh, that's interesting. Yeah, give me a minute. So How could you not like first? see who we go on. Not that I don't like um, it, I actually do. It's just all my stuff stuff. Uh, Algrid, to be perfectly honest, it's one of the few places in Star Citizen I can actually spell. Actually, I'm going to raid this guy, because I, I was talking to him, he's a fairly new guy. And he had mm -hmm. no bloody clue who I was. And I'm, I thought that was cool because, like, he was friendly talking to me and stuff like that. And he had no idea who I was. So we'll give him a little stream. That's cool. Um, and I like it when people are friendly like that. So he doesn't have the coolest name, but it's, um, you'll understand when I, when I go to read him why. Uh, so his, his name is Thumb in Your Bum. Uh, but, uh, oh. very, very, very Aussie, uh, type of thing. But he's not actually Aussie. Um, uh, wait. Uh, the channel has followers on subscribably only chat. Wait. Oh no. Uh, Is it follower yeah. only? Yeah. Let me let me check. Let me check. Because I I I have got a rule where I don't raid anyone that's got follower only. Uh, yeah, we like that. that. Yeah, I, I think that is kind of shit if that's what he's got. It's cheating. Um, wait. Have I put an extra B in it? No, he has two M's for bum. Okay. Yeah. You already have a raid in progress. Oh no. Yeah, it's ready to go. Uh, not everyone looks like they're getting sucked over though, so only 39 people going over. But anyway, all right, um, I will cut this back over to the standard view. Wait, Agrid's not going to be there, I just realized. Hang on. Thank you for the landing, uh, Mr. Sangropa. Right, uh, don't forget to like, subscribe, ring that notification bell, and thank you to everyone on the end of the video that went next from on Patreon. Um, other than Agrid, is there anything you want to say before we sign off? No, thanks guys for coming and hanging out with us tonight and uh, joining the discourse shenanigans uh, chaos shenanigans the discourse yes um thanks for everyone that joined us in discord too it was great hanging out with everyone having a good chat at, um that's what I I like. beyond yeah. measure i'm just doing it saying my to help just, just saying my thanks <laughs> yeah. yeah i'm allowed to do that too let me alone you bully uh anyway um all right well the voices in the voids have been lots <laughs> of people and i've been execute and we'll catch you in the next one and, and we're out of here take care Stay citizens. Wait, oh, I gotta do the raid button. Oh, they've already gone. I think they've already gone. Yes, they've already gone. They sucked away. All right, cool. No worries. See you, citizens. Bye. Bye. You can say goodbye, everyone, if you want to say goodbye. Bye, bye. 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 Bye.